Hey guys, Barry here from TGS with another Assassin's Creed Valhalla Series X live stream. I'm gonna do a mix of exploring and story today, most likely, number 40. This game is getting a lot of streams. It's gotten uh, pretty far up there, but not really surprised. It is an absolutely massive game. We are getting close to the end, but we're still, uh, you know, a stretch away. We'll cover all that in the intro and get started. But uh, basically, for anyone who saw yesterday, just a continuation of what we did this week so far. We're able to complete the region, but now we got to start the missions. And then uh, there's only three regions left, including one that has not been, uh, you know, provided to us yet. Or yet, it's uh, I believe probably the final missions in the game. Spoiler, you know, spoiler, but it's uh, Vinland, which means I'm pretty sure that means they're uh, coming across the Atlantic. But uh, I don't think it's that big of an area, but still stuff to do. I also spotted the uh, new DLC coming out. It seemed like it was a small map with a bunch of small kingdoms. I'm not sure, you know, how much effort and time is going to need to go into that DLC. It might be much more massive than I predicted, but uh, after looking through the achievements, I think our playthrough is going to take a little bit longer than I planned anyway. So uh, we'll do our best to get this game done and its DLC and get back to Legion at some point or mix it up later on, but we'll decide what's best as we go down the road. But the main goal is to focus on Valhalla only for now as this game is a lot more time consuming and it has a major DLC coming, I believe, tomorrow, so. Let's go over our usual intro, uh, you know, started maybe a minute or two late, so no big deal, uh, because we planned an expanded afternoon today. So, since I have to cut tomorrow uh, one hour short, we're going to be giving that extra hour to today as the goal. So our goal is going to be to go from 1 to 3.30, then 4 to 6.30 or something like that, based on how I feel if I get uh, exhausted. You know, obviously cut by six or something like that, but if I can pull through, I'll try and do it all, and, uh, you know, we'll push on and get a lot done today. Otherwise, you know, uh, I guess let's just, yeah, let's just tackle as much as possible. There's nothing else to say. I wasn't sure if I had uh, something else to say about the game, but, yeah, that's the plan for the day. So, uh, two and a half from one to three thirty. Thirty minute break is all definitely needed, and then another up to two and a half from four to six thirty. Abnormal, but uh, I decided you know, we probably need it today. As per uh, you know, the plan for the game, we're going for a 1k playthrough, all the main story missions, all the side missions, the collectibles, everything included. I'll probably even do the treasure hunting and all that so we can make it a 100% run, but uh, that means there's still a lot to do. So uh, hoping within a week or two we'll be done, but uh, definitely not this week. So before I go over the schedule for the week, definitely appreciate if you like and sub. Website thegamersociety.com. Two clubs on Xbox, the Gamer Society Fan Club, TJ Screenshot Club. We also have our social description and support links. Razor stores on Razor Streamer. Rep sports with the coupon code TGS for 15% off. Forget Razor Energy. Link if you're looking to buy the game. Check it all out. As per the schedule for the rest of the week, let's just slam it out and then we'll uh, start playing. So uh, that'll finish out our intro. So tomorrow we're going to be running Valhalla from uh, roughly 3 to 6. I have to start late. I have something to do earlier. Now, if I can start earlier, I will, but I doubt it. I will at least hold three hours tomorrow, hence why we're doing a whole extra hour today, so two and a half per half today instead of just two. It'll be exhausting, but uh, I'll try and push through. Moving on to Friday, we're going to be doing Cold War at 1 o'clock, Warzone at 3.30. Friday night, Dead by Daylight, 9 o'clock, giving it the early slot for once, and then we'll do Minecraft around... Uh, 11.30. There's a possibility that could be changed to Tony Hawk Pro Skater 1 Plus 2, but no guarantees. It's basically going to be based on who's joining and stuff like that, but we'll worry about that later in the week. Because one of these uh, upcoming weeks, I definitely want to replace either DVD or Minecraft with the Tony Hawk game. Because it's been a while since we played it. Moving on to Saturday, around uh, 2.30, we're going to do COD Modern Warfare Remastered. Around uh, 5 o'clock, we should be doing COD World War II. Moving on to Saturday night, 11 Plus GTA 5. Back to back till like 3 or so in the morning. And now Sunday, Lego Harry, approximately 4 o'clock to uh, start our second playthrough. That's it for the week for Random Talk. Got nothing. There's really nothing else going on this week. No uh, new shows or anything. Going to watch uh, Angel Has Fallen, the final movie in that trilogy. That's pretty much the only thing going on for me. So let's go ahead and start. I think there's like 5 or 6 missions on this storyline. So hopefully it doesn't take too long. Trying to speak to Gunner in Western... So let's head on down. Still wearing my uh, 
Thor outfit. We have to get his cape, but we get that later on. There's also uh, some other special weapons I want to unlock at some point. Go. So the west side of town means I'm going to head over here. Yeah, feel free to post in chat. It's kind of open discussion while we're not, uh, you know, or in the main missions and stuff. I'm not going to speak over cutscenes. I'm going to respect them. I'm going to focus on the story. Then when we're running around exploring, we can hold a kind of open, random discussion. But when we're doing missions, I like to kind of clean it up a little bit. Don't want to be ranting on about like a Star Wars game while we're uh, in the middle of a boss fight. So we figure out where he is. We've been working to uh, get our websites, uh, well, my websites, including the TGS website, moved to a new host, and then I'm going to go ahead and uh, rebuild them from scratch. So just note, the website is going down temporarily. Maybe down for a few weeks at most. Uh, I'll just make sure to post the Discord with our schedule. So be sure to join our Discord if you uh, want more info on the schedule. It is that easy. Maybe I'll start trying to post them in the uh, on the YouTube as well. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Where the hell is he? Slightly out of his loop. There you are, Gunner. And with a smile like I haven't seen in some time. Eivor, over here. Love how I just notices him. Thought I smelt you under wind. Gunnar, with the speed you left home, I thought you'd been carried off by Valkyries. I have. This Valkyrie right here, Bridget, my own heart's root. Meet Aver. It takes a rare woman to nail down our Gunnar. Bavendin da, with my Zigwili. Uh, good to meet you as well. How did you find a woman in these backwoods? She came through the settlement selling runes, outshone every stone in her satchel. She offered me a trade, a rune for a brooch I was making. I got a better deal. But she loves the ugly little thing. Have you uh, a family, Britain? If mom and dad carried even gilder than I couldn't help Drew's me. Bricks of man power, the last high priestess and elderman. They since passed on. But the current elderman looks out for her. I should like to meet this elderman of yours, if our kinfolk are to be joined. A union forged in love. Come, we we'll go find him. Oh, and don't blame me if he's heard a tale or two about you. What about it, Bridge? Tim Jolch, you two bags of air, see how compass but Eivor Gal, please sound. Right? No daylight to waste then, huh? Uh, it's so a strange relationship, man. I'm gonna check his house out, see what's going on here. Not all from me. Your name will be on the lips of every skull for years to come. <laughs> and the Mercians here are not unsettled by lurking Viking. Yet? They come from all over to celebrate Sawin. Most are too busy with the festivities to pay on the line. Samhain? Is that what these carved roots are for? This tradition? Aye. Faces cut into lanterns to ward off evil spirits and guide children home. They have a haunted look about them. Let us bring a few back. Just to warn everyone, I'm supposed to get a package today, and then the Felucter Volts can't get the door quickly. I gotta do it because we got a sign for it, so. Just wanna let you know, because I don't wanna miss it, so I'll uh, probably like go into insta pause if uh, I'm on duty to get the door. Thankfully, it's not online. There is the Elder Man! Kunan! A good leader, seeing to his people's needs. Let us join hands when his task is done. Yeah. Then let's introduce you to Tevdur. Hands as clammy as a dead haddock, but his heart is in the right place. And he'll be Elderman after Kunan. 
Tevdor, this is Eivor, my chieftain. Ah, yes. The way Gunnar speaks, I expected, uh... Me to ride in on a winged horse, cure the sick, the blind. His compliments are as blunt as his hammer. Ah, more pagans crowding our table. Just lovely. Well, what brings you here? I am here to hasten my friend's marriage and drink my weight in ale. If friendship comes afterwards, then all the better. And what has Dane friendship done for Christian Mercia? Unseated god right kings for puppet rulers? So-called puppet kings keep your lands safe and your bellies full. I ask no thanks. Only hospitality. A apples! Eivor, wait until you try the cider. You, you like cider, eh? Tevder? Cider? Ah, you must be Eivor. Tevder, I see you've welcomed our honored guest. Come just in time for my last Samhain. At your behest. We welcome all pagans set upon God's own Gloucester. Tevder! As your Harvest King, I demand that you remove the turnip from your arse and be merry! So, you've come to meet the family, before you whisk my Bridget away to her life as a smithy's bride. We're honored to have her join the Raven Clan, but your lush landscape will be hard to match. I must give away girl and land in this misty season, but Gunnar is a good man, and he speaks tirelessly of you. If you will excuse me, I have matters to attend to. Ah, yes, the shrine. And with so many thieves and fangs on the path, a fellow may fall in God's service. Kunon, I do not need a heathen escort. Youth cut down in its prime, without even the memory of warm thighs and cider to sustain him in the afterlife. Then... By my honor, I shall not rest until I return him to you safely. Aye, Tefter? I see I am outmatched. Though a Dane joining in praise to Saint Kenhelm? God will weep. My lady love calls, Eivor. Oh, if you'd like to join us later, we're going hoodening this eve. Go! May you have a fire-forged friendship. Watch for fairies, fenfolk, and fiends. I have a hand fastening to oversee, an apprenticeship to officiate, and a pig to slaughter. <clears throat> well, shall we then? A tale of wicker fire. Sowen. <laughs> Kunon humors these pagans too much. It is the first thing gone when I am Elderman. Fires and magic. Spirits in the air. Gloucestershire has strayed from God's light. People need carousing, especially before the winds of frost. The festival brings warmth and cheer. God's light does not dim as the nights chill, but the winters are hard upon the children. Seeing them run around, it lightens the heart. Are there priests in your lands? I've met a few, liked even fewer. The profane has gone unchallenged here. I alone am the Reformation. They are a flock in need of my shepherding. And how will you lead this great renewal? They will fill the church's pews and we will thank him for all the gifts he brings. Not false idols of wood and clay. And yet, are we not going to pray at the idol of another? Is this Saint Canom your god? No, and we do not call him such. He is simply closer to the Lord's ear. Low in a mead of kine under a thorn, lieth poor Kenhelm, kingborn. Is this land not beautiful, Eivor? Aye. Look, the path is untouched by danger, so your company is not needed. You are a kinder man than the mask you wear. But you won't be rid of me. I will keep my word to Kunan for your safe return.
I don't understand this Christian praying. I thank Odin while standing. Why get your knees dirty? To humble ourselves before God. Besides, I've dirtied my knees doing worse. That sounds like a tale I'd like to lend my ear to. Please, Eivor, I must pray. Should I watch or turn my back? Oh, Lord, gift upon this lowly servant your greatest gift. Patience. I will not have to interrupt your prayer to protect you, Tefta. And yet you insist on doing so. What is it you are looking at? A hare? Tefta, get to safety. Find somewhere to hide. Damn. How's that name? Is he running away? What the hell, man? What the? Aim? Why does the aim do that? It's like sticky now, like. Flies forward. Oh, wore myself up apparently. Eivor, <laughs> thank you for saving my life. It's good I was here to protect you. Maybe Kunan has the eyes of prophecy. Splude. Cloven hoofed and sent by Lucifer himself. This land must be returned to God's grace. More likely, the shrine is in their territory. Lord, we thank thee for your protection. It's not safe here. Give me my moment's prayer, Eivor. I ask only this. We should return to Gloucester. Unless you'd like to thank the little martyr here for tonight's feast. I'm not a babe in the woods in need of constant guard. Go on without me. I gave Kunan... Yes, yes, your word. And when I see him, I will say you protected me from being skewered upon those devil's tusks. Oh, and Eivor... I owe you a drink, at least. Later, if you'd have one. Find me at the festivities. Seems like he wants me to, uh... Leave him, so I will. I'm gonna try to have one of those uh, new bourbon burgers from Wendy's. Honestly, pretty good. I'd recommend trying it. Just for a uh, random chat. We're in Gunner's house. Eivor, there you are. Here I am. So, what adventures did you find in my absence? Escorted Tefter to the shrine of some Christian saint. Our path was not peaceful. We were accosted by a group of boars. Odd, but path and I usually south. To the Brivo. But you saved his hide. I bet it was quite the sight. Two of you as a pair. How did Tefter become Kunan's successor? He speaks with his god's fire, but I do not quite believe it. I watched the Egloy's father's harden call on Tefter. He believes my venade's quite do. Hmm, tragic that is. But I think the lad can still be molded, Eivor. You might be just the one to do that. I need a drink. Try the cider. It's from last year's apple harvest. Skull. Skull. So, you invited me to a hoodening. What mischief is this? Nigwiskal Anvela spread you on creatures of the Vale. The bag for treats. Clawashester gives their glut to otherworldly visitors, and if you dress as one, you'll get that bounty yourself. Freely given? Huh. I have only seen such a thing done at feasts. Then we turn you into a beastie and have you roam the hills, praying for sweets and drink. It's hardly a disguise, just a cloak and some bones. 
Nonsense. You are the very spirit of the Mary Louvre. Now, let's hooden. Become the Mary Louvre, the spirit who sings for cake and ale. And you cannot have your cloak back until we leave. I'll keep this covering, but even a... Gunner, if no one else is dressed this way, I will fill your shop with sheep. That house for sure. Just, uh, hinting at Halloween. Are you ready to rhyme with me? Down the road from my abode, there is an open veil. Hope to God this Mary Lewitt doesn't fail. Oh, have a cake for your troubles then. <laughs> Apparently we're trick-or-treating as an adult. Man, what happened? <laughs> Good. Oh, thank the gods. We've been waiting for children all night to empty our store so we can go to the party. Have some extra. Ah, lads getting into their cups, scaring the wee ones. Trick or treat. I have come to rhyme with you. In the gloaming, see her roaming hidden neath the hood. To its dwelling, face foretelling, it's the Mary Louis. Well done. <laughs> Look at this. Yeah. Sweet as honey, Gunnar. You should see this. Gunnar. My cakes. Let's see you, old friend. Then, through the mist of the night, they saw a woman. Let's go down here. There he is. What did you say to me? I said, come on. Take your false gods and piss off them. You are either fearless or stupid, boy, to speak to someone of the Raven Clan this way. Fitting name for scavengers. Winged rats taking what isn't yours. I'll pick out your eyes and feed them to your god. Gunnar, we are guests here. Let him go. We can hooden more. <laughs> you seem to want your nose broken, so let me oblige. Christ and Tor. Finish him! Look, we We're tag teaming this dude. Alive. Beat him up, Gunner. Ah! Bringing WWE up in here, apparently. You don't want to stay in Gloucester. They know how to have fun. I don't know what the hell's up with that camera angle, like, huh? Gunner. Beunivalis McCallum. Gunner, seriously, you're already done. It barely hurts me because my level's so high. And we beat him. Enough! Keep your brawls to the other side of the river. There's children about. I don't answer to you, witch. Thomas Fletcher, I brought you into this world, wiped your mother's birth blood from your face. Mind your tongue. Let's see that leg then. It's nothing. Careful with the old man. He's had many winters worth of wounds. To Lucas, Modron's a compass to patch this land. That man called you a witch. I lead those who follow the old ways in Gloucestershire, but I offer my healing services on both sides of the river. Gwenith, my love, go back to the house and bring me the garlic salt. And the worms? Are we cleaning or cutting, mother? Yes, grab the worms just to be safe. Now go, child. 
I promise not to cut it off before your return. I'll give me strength. A man modern is known I'm a humor toish good run. I'm glad you all finding my mortal <laughs> injury so funny. Go, Eivor. Make Marion try to loosen Tempter's shoulders. Madrum, you don't have to save his leg. I will understand. That limb will be fine. But no medicine in England will stop the dribble from his mouth. I do not work miracles. And they're making fun of him for being an old man. Poor gunner. <laughs> Speak to this a hole. With bitter ale and sweet friends. That is a fine way to end the day. Eivor, there you are. Tefter. You're well met. Gwilim here has challenged my honor in a contest of drinks. Join us. The lab will be easy pickings. Give me a cup. Some ale, then. One for me as well. For shaveling of the Christ Lord, you have a lot of scars, Gwillem. Not every tonsured man is a wet-eared abbey, babe. I came to God after I had scarred my soul with sin. To holy hearths and humid eyes, it is the best drunkenness returns a man to royal reason. Skull. Oh, it's about to go down. It's one of those really long uh, battles. We'll have to uh, make sure we don't mess it up. Staggering already. Got some on your boots. More more me than that. You are sweating. In arms, drink a hog's head of ale faster. Drink. You are a bit green, friend. Come on, lad. Show the dame your metal. Oops. I was looking over at his uh, cups, and I'm, that was my first mistake. I shouldn't have looked over, I should have just grinded it. When I clicked the uh, button to save myself, it was a second too late. I wasn't sure if he was... It seemed like he's decently behind as long as I don't F up. Yep, got him. <laughs> this merriment feeds my soul. Here, another drink on me for allies new and old. Of all the Eldermen I've met, you're the most unburdened. What is your secret? None. It is well known. The burdens I carry will soon leave this world with me. So drink to my life and death. Death? I am to be sacrificed in the Wicker Man as King of the Harvest. Like Elderman Simkin before me, and all before him. Horrible barbaric practice. A burnt offering after poor crops. They hope well-fed gods will smile upon them. <laughs> A toast, then. To Elderman Coonan, joyous and generous. Let each man show him loyalty until he suffers death. My friends, you are kind to me. I'd like to toast my successor, Tevder. May he wear the horns head high. Weak. 
What is this? Water? I feel like Thor chugging oceans. No effect to my head or step. <laughs> you had the man. Give him something stronger. <laughs> this will work faster than any tonic. Good. Give me visions of all creatures that roam these hills. And the sore head tomorrow to pay for it. Wow, that tastes awful. It feels good, though. Eivor, speak true. My feelings be damned. I have been an ass. Do not deny it. And I, for that, I am sorry. A colossal horse's ass. Yes. Soft words from the heartless heathen. Only fiercer than fire among ill friends. I can be very as nice as a spring gale. <laughs> and how nice is that? Very, very nice. I think I might <laughs> like you even better when you're me. Tefta, with Gunnar and Bridget's marriage, our clans will unite. But we could join by oath as well. Oh, yes. My first ally as Elderman. I accept. We shall make an oath. How do we start? Yeah. The greatest, greatest oath, and the greatest union. To the oath! The treaty! The greatest! <laughs> shh, shh, shh. People are sleeping. More ale to seal our friendship? <laughs> this way, this way. Look out for the black sow. <laughs> sow? Like pig? Flaming pig. Chases you home at night. <clears throat> silly words to scare silly children. <sighs> you see magic as the stuff of children's dreams. Perhaps... I judge too much. Truths I half believe. Foolishness sometimes takes my time. <laughs> uh, a great right, chases stars across oh God, the stairs. In great whirls of color and light. Whoosh, whoosh. Here we are. Right inside here. I feel warm. Do you feel warm? Always warm here. It's a wonder you don't walk around naked. Yes, um, well, come on in. Tefter! 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 Where are you? <laughs> How they have their controlled blackouts. They're like, I'll wait until I'm at the specific place. Hell's breath. What happened last night? Uh, and the effects of that draft still cling. Tefter, are you here? Tefter's bodyguard. Killed by knife. There's a row, uh, a note. This 
part has been broken, and it's covered in blood. A weapon, maybe. Blood. Could be Tefters, if he was the heavy thing being dragged. So, there we go. Muddy footprints. Someone was hiding back here. What's happened here? Open this door! Come out of there! Willem's pouch. I wonder if it still has a little something stronger. But why is it here? Better hold on to it. So, what does this lead to? The murderers hid here, lying in wait while we approached outside. They jumped from the shadows to kill the bodyguards. And to disable Tefta. Then they dragged him away. That accounts for everything. Except Gwilym's pouch of herbs. I'm still unbalanced by Gwilym's special something. Maybe Mother Modron will know the contents. What is the meaning of this? Blood soaking our soil, and your weapon coated in the same! Kunan, please. More has happened here than you can see. Give me a right to parley my innocence. I should have heeded Tevder's misgivings about heathen party guests, and now he has paid with his life. With Tevder gone, Glowachester will be without an elderman. Eye for an eye, your Raven clan will lose their chieftain! Get the murderer! Let's be out. Just trying to avoid any energy boost today because I uh, had that bourbon burger from Wendy's and I had a uh, small mini Coke, whatever they're called. Yeah, I guess they're called mini Cokes. With it, but that definitely didn't provide much caffeine, so I may still end up grabbing something. Some of the parent had a bunch of stuff here that I was unaware of. sit here and lecture people on caffeine but uh I'm always trying to make sure I have a good balance and limit myself to like equivalent of like two energy drinks a week but I split them down to half cans instead of uh, you know full size and I'm saving a full half can for a cod I'm sick to cold brew on Saturdays afternoon streams and I already had cold brew I think Monday so I felt like today was the best day so I might uh grab myself something Hello again. Mother, it's the friend of the mangled leg man. Eivor, you remember? Indeed. It's a surprise to see you. Is everything quite all right?
No, it's not. I awoke in Tefter's wrecked home. Blood, but no body. Kunin's men are after me for the lad's murder. Uh-oh. Did you stab him? Mother, can I see? Blood, but no body? We must see what has happened to him. Do you recognize the contents of this pouch? A very unusual blend. There is a druid who uses this mix to aid sleep. A monk called Gwillem poured some of it into my drink last night. The effects were intense. Smash the houses! Cardigan fire! They're coming for you. If they know I've aided you, it'll be my head next. Can you? I've seen nothing and no one. Mother, if the stranger wants more of the herbs, they can talk to the druid Halewin. Yes. Halewin's cabin is on a lake near where the Cherwell and Great Ouse rivers meet. But he is a strange fish. Rarely does he speak to mortals, preferring the company of spirits. Now, I've business at Rollandrich. Find me there later. So, eastern part, Great Ouse. So he's right over here somewhere, so our best bets are probably fast travel here, just go up river. Okay, guys, just warning you guys, I'm on alert. Uh, if Electro Volts can't get the door when it rings, I have to immediately pause and run off. It's been pretty quiet here today. I don't think we have many people stop by. It's been our quietest day of ACV this week, I guess. But I did start a half hour early. So maybe we'll uh, see some of our regulars later on, maybe not. Perks of being a... Uh, Hello, Subcount Street. <laughs> but I enjoy gaming, so why the hell not be on? What the hell am I wearing anyway? They didn't change any of my stuff, it just the mask is still on. I end up grabbing that energy boost uh, in a little bit. I'm kind of craving something sweet too, but it wouldn't make sense to uh, down a bunch of sugar with an uh, energy drink because then you know you're going to have that crash. But I'll probably at least grab the energy boost. I definitely need the full break today. I got uh, some stuff to do. I completely forgot I uh, sold something online and was supposed to ship it out today. So I have to box it up, make sure it gets out tomorrow, and let them know because I'm not an a-hole, but it does happen. Once in a blue moon. Some other stuff pop up uh, today. So. It's cottage on the eastern right on a lake. Alright, so there it is, the Druid's Cottage. Random chat. I think I'm gonna watch that Tom Clancy movie uh, next week. Just came out uh, not too long ago, so that'd be pretty cool. I don't know, I'm brain farting a name, but uh, I forget if it was something. That must be the home of the droid. I forget if they're doing something division related or something. I don't remember. We'll find out when we see it. land is peopled by men of straw. Oh, spirit! You have finally come! Days ago, a passing cloud foretold your arrival with droplets of sun-scented rain. But what form of being are you beneath this guise of horse and bone? From the realm of the Fey? I know you cannot say. I, I press no more. Whatever you be, now you are here, the ritual may begin. Oh, but the men of straw must announce you with sparks. Ignite the sky to begin anew, here at the death of the season. Until then, I await you. 
giving thanks in the glen. Where's that one more at? Is it you? There it is. They roar! Do you hear them? A chorus of fire! That should be the last one. Back to the druid. Speak to me, O oh wind. I've come to ask you a single question. Something about your demeanor and your physical manifestation now gives me pause. Are you truly a spirit of light? I am a spirit as any other. Then prove it. You must know the depths of the world's mysteries before I will help you. Tell me the proper use of charms. Very well. Ask your riddles. Which charm summons aid for maidens? Give me a measure of time. Are you a spirit of darkness? If it be not so, come back and try anew. What are these things he's asking me? There must be trinkets around his house that will help. is placed upside down. A hangman's noose, a knife, and the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. been screaming secrets. This symbol is one I've seen carved into shields and headstones. Apparently one under there. Oh, there's a wall. Two ladles carved from a single branch. The grooves match. Two ladles carved from a single branch. I'm trying to read that note. Grooves match. There we go. As long as we got them all, we should be able to get all the riddles right now. Speak to me, O oh wind. Have you found yourself? If you are a spirit of light, answer me this. Which charm summons aid for maidens? Is that really the only option? What the hell? Are you a the hell are we missing? Maybe something out back? It's not even giving me the answer as an option. Zunin, guide me.
He's the only thing popping up. around his house. Their mouths are open, like they've been screaming secrets. This dagger is placed upside down. Let's make sure they all like registered. The hangman's noose, a knife, and the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. Why can't I? Give me Why don't I have the answer? There's absolutely nothing else that says we can collect it around here. There it goes, finally. Did I just see it for a second? Something just flashed and went away, guys. I don't know if you saw that. Maybe we found what we need. It was underground. There it is, for fuck's sake. I was like, man. This game has a few breaking bugs. I was like, nope. The statue of a woman, Sabrina, watches me from the water below. This is the answer to the first question. Thank gosh. Let's go. Have you found We've heard this like five times, so there we go. Maidens in peril are protected by Sabrina after seven. Sabrina the water nymph, yes. Which is the charm that weds souls? The charm of the double spoon. Yes. Such that a wedded pair can sup broth together. Man and woman are made of earth, of water, and wind. Which charm clods the earth, dries the water, and stills the wind? Threefold death stops life's wind, returns a body to earth, and renders water into poison. Threefold death is the charm. <laughs> you are a spirit of light. Mabon be praised. Would you like some bread and cream? No, just the answer to a question. This herb pouch made its way to Gloucester in the hands of a strange man. Do you know it? Aye. A mix to help him sleep, I filled this very pouch. And over a dandelion wine, he spoke fondly of his home, Kuth Lodron. Kud Lodron? <clears throat> very well. I thank you, Halwyn. But this spirit has others to visit this harvest moon. Go with the wind and leaves, good friend of the hills. Kuth Ladron. Strange name. Meanwhile, Modron awaits me at the stones nearby. Clues and riddles completed. We're gonna hop right into the next one. The Stolen King. There's four missions left in this uh, storyline. We're done two. We're almost an hour in, so if we're lucky, by the time we hit the two and a half hour break, we might be able to uh, 
get the story done. If I could, I'd like to... So overall, my goal, I think, this week was uh, to finish out Yervikshire on Monday. Or Monday, Tuesday, something like that, then do Gloucestershire today. And tomorrow, do uh, Hamptonshire in the final region and Vinland next week. But we still have to mop up uh, DLC, but we're like a day ahead right now, so of my initial plan. But that doesn't mean much. What do you see, Sunan? So we still have quite a bit to do. The best part is, though, Hamptonshire and some of these other areas don't have, uh, you know, six missions. We'll have like two, which makes our lives a little bit easier. I can see Mutter in the head. How far has the search for me stretched? Far enough to say it's best you stick to the countryside and wear that disguise. But Tefter's body has not been found as yet. That night was full of drink and merriment. I do not remember much, but I had no quarrel with Tefter. A sorry tale. Did you learn anything from Halewin? He gave some herbs to a man from Kuth Lodren, name of Gwilim. He was drinking with Tefter and myself. Kuth Lodren is the Welsh name for the thieves Warren. It's atop a hill west of here. I can lead you. I owe you a great deal for all your aid. You did not have to trust me. Tevder's fate is to my interest as well. This is a troubling development that I hope to get to the bottom of. Let's make haste then. I must find Gwilim and regain my honor. This forest and all of Gloucestershire feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through a door to another world. Aye, there is old magic here. Old magic that would be snuffed out by Tevder and his church. Tevder did speak of reformation. Do you think that's why he was targeted? There are many who would claw their way to the top. Tevder's disappearance could be the work of any. But you are a witch. Open to wisdom from the guards. Have you seen anything? I see much smoke. Are there any rival Danes passing through who could have done it? If it were rival Danes, we would have heard their horns by now. We are not a humble sort. Blunt tongues and sharp axes. Taking a nice cruise around the countryside, apparently. Kuth Ludren, the Thieves Warren. This is where I leave you. You'll find somewhere safe. There's a shrine nearby. If you've need of me, then meet me there. Gods old and new go with you. to follow the road. Still got an hour and a half till I take a break. Two and a half, then a 30 minute break, then another up to two and a half today. This is definitely a nice cruise up the mountain. They would have had eyes on us for a while by now with that view. Aid me. Be my eyes. No! Best not to draw attention here. What 
do you see? Learned this from one of the daughters of Naimu. They're blessed in holy healing. It should help with the pain. Thank you, Harry. You've been a great comfort. That is Tefter's voice. So he lives. That must be where Aquilim is hiding. Stop, don't make noise. You got me caught, you motherfucker. <laughs> Ow. How the fuck to get in the house? Oh, we figured it out. Oh shit. Oh shit is right. Eivor, you're alive. Have mercy. I would under all this. Elderman Coonan, he gave us coin to dispose of Tepter. Then he should demand it back. Shit sales haunt you are. Cannot kill a single man. You made a poor choice in scapegoat, Gwilym. And we thought that if we kept the lad alive, we could squeeze Coonan for more coin to keep it secret. Coonan is meeting his end in the Wicker Man at the end of the Samhain celebrations. Look, we wasn't gonna kill the lad. We've come to like having him around. Tell him, tell him we've taken care of you. Kunar did this? Why? I've done nothing. Oh, gods, is he dead? Wake up, wake up. Tell the Dane I've hand fed you like a baby sparrow. Ah, move, fool. Ah. Look, Eivor, we're mates, right? Uh, had drinks together. Remember the chickens? Speak again and I'll take your tongue. Tafter will need to see a healer. This lord have been smearing dung on his face. But I've been held for ransom by worse men. Thank you for your aid, then. And try not to get held for ransom a third time after you flee. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. It is much appreciated. Carry him by foot at, w at once. <laughs> Just run all the way back by foot. Why's my mount not available? I'm outside. Mother floor. I awoke in this demon lair. I feared the worst. Save your strength, Tefter. It's a long ride. Kunon. He ordered my death. I don't understand. He's been like a father to me. I will ask him myself. All right, can you please stop moving? When he spoke of the Thank you. Being just, as we. just like a real dog, he got overly excited and ran around. <laughs> One face, many faces. I ain't avenging that, dude. I've avenged too many people in this game. Waste of time. Be alive in his glory. The scrape has changed you, Tefter. Changed me. He's hot to the touch, and his mind fades in and out. But he lives. Perhaps a sickness of the blood. Shame, shame. He was captured by the men there? They claimed to have been hired by Kunan. 
Hunan did this? I know not why. Only that he gave them coin to dispose of Tefter. You can see how well they saw to that. They were alike once, the boy and Kunan. God-fearing Christians arguing the nature of life with me. But he softened. Men do great evil to cling on to power and save their skin. Perhaps he means to put Tevder to flame in his place. Does not the right demand the leader? If he made the lad's body Elderman, then it would still be right to sacrifice. Then he's not safe until I've dealt with Kunan. Can you tend to his wounds? I am a very good healer. But if the gods want him to join them, I cannot stop their will. Eivor, what will you do with Kunan? I will reveal his sins. Let his people decide if he deserves an honorable death. The man tarnished your name and you would let him live? Shame for shame. Not even his guard will welcome him when I'm done. You are resolute then. Then may you ride as Rhiannon. Thank you, Modern. And please, take care of Tefter. I must get to Kunan before the festival's end. The stolen key. Means we have to work our way uh, over there. All the way back down here, might as well fast travel in the port. I must find Kunan before I'm spotted. The longhouse is a good place to start. say before the next mission I was gonna take a one minute break we're playing for two and a half hours and taking our actual break and then playing another two and a half hours but uh I need to go grab a drink I'm gonna grab myself an energy boost had a uh, had a mini coke with my uh, crazy burger earlier for lunch it is not doing the justice and being an extremely long afternoon of uh, Valhalla I think we're gonna hit up to five hours game time today which is crazy and uh, I figure I might as well go uh, do that real quick. So I'm going to take a one minute break, guys. Sorry to uh, disrupt the stream, but I'll be right back.
I'm back, guys. Should be good to go. Let's go ahead and get the show on the road. Grab myself a... Uh, not feeling a uh, too much energy drink today. So I just got myself a half can. Figure, uh, yeah. Drink it over the course of the next hour or two. Should be able to push on till 6.30 as planned, which is still over four hours away, nonetheless. Where are you, Kuna? He isn't here. If I took over a minute, sorry about that, I had uh, an app alert to connect something, and I uh, did it real quick. I have this app where uh, when you make purchases, you get money in stock. So, for instance, you could pick like a bunch of different fast food places. Like You can be like, oh, I go to McDonald's, and you get 1% of stocks every time you go to McDonald's. So, uh, yeah, they have Burger King, McDonald's, Wendy's. They have uh, food stores. They have... Wholesale stores, they have everything. And it's pretty sweet. It's a really select program. I know, like, out of, like, five people that applied, only me and one other person got into the program. Because they were, like, testing it out, and then they changed it, and then they changed it to where you have to buy stuff online to get the money. And then I stopped using it, and then they brought it back. So, uh, you know, you connect the, like, your bank or whatever that show, you know, when they see, uh, you know, you made a payment to a certain company, you'll get stocks for it. I have a pretty awesome-looking stock portfolio from that, from... Everything from BK to Mickey D's to Wendy's to this to that to Uber, it's all covered in the app. So I've gotten quite a few stocks out of it, so it's pretty cool. And also there's companies where you can actually select to get other stocks, so I can actually get Tesla stocks, stock like, you know, stuff like that, instead of getting the rewards at the, uh, you know, the company of choice. I usually leave it at the company of choice, get a more diverse portfolio, because, you know, 1% of 10 bucks for your lunch or whatever is what, a dollar? I mean, 10 cents, so that's all the stocks you get. Either way, let's continue with the story. Nothing about that app. It is called Bumped, though, B-U-M-P-E-D. Just to throw it out there, if you guys never heard of it, I'd recommend checking it out. No guarantee you'll get into it, but uh, you can still try and see what happens. I think I've gotten over 50 bucks on there, so it gives you a good idea. Yeah, Easily rack up a nice amount of stock. Eivor! Finally, Tiri de Hwaled! Bridget, it is good to see you. Eivor, what has become of Tevder? Did you faint your scarf? Uh, thank you. Gunner as well? Dowl am your whereabouts, and dichel am your dathliadai. Bridget, I found an abandoned bird nest in the rafters. I'm going to take it home to Mother. If you gaddle it, then the babans will do it no all lay it got. It's you again! The Sowen Butcher! The Sowen Butcher? Never mind. Gwynedd, I'm looking for Kunan. Have you seen him? He's busy with the festival and shooed me away to Bridget. Would you like to see some magic I've been practicing? Can you show me to Kunan if I say yes? Just one trick and then I can show you around. Um, okay. So reach into this pouch! And the number of stones you're holding is... three! Wonderful magic, Gwen. Now I really need to find Kunan. Come on, let's go find him! There are the church ladies! They don't like the festival, but Mama says they come anyway to cluck cluck like hens. Do you want... I would know more about you, Gwyneth. You are certainly an odd little bird. Mother says there'll be no one like me in the whole of creation. From the dawn of dust to the end of sorrows. Your mother trusts you. Let you run about on your own. She spends the holiday blessing hermits in old rocks. What fun is that? And your father, Gwyneth? Where is he? Well, it's not to be spoken of. But, I was born from the union of my mother, with the Horned King of the Forest, Genunos. You are close with Bridget? She's like a big sister. But it's not like I'm going to get to see her much anymore, once she leaves with you and Gunnar. How do you spend your days, Gwyneth? Collecting dead things for Mama's spells. I have quite a collection. 
birds, mice, um, beetles, and I dance, and I can talk to cats. I should find Kunan. Do you want to see another trick? I can pull an acorn from your ear. I need to find... I would know more about... Mother says... I rarely talk to her now. It's important. You're lost, Butcher. It's Avon. Read or tev der and govlim. My priority speed depends on Rachid. I don't know what she's. <laughs> Not trying to be mean, but like, there's like absolutely no uh, understanding there. Have a look, Sunan. Why is that woman wearing a striped mask? That's a badger. All the festival ladies in charge wear one. Have you seen Elderman Coonan? Oh, that unholy visage startled me. It's past sundown, so Kunon has retired to the church for prayer. I have business with him. Even if you have business with him, it will have to wait until the morning. Locked himself in, only Geva has the key. Would Geva let me in? She's been instructed not to. Not that I can see her following a task so simple. Girl'd forget her own head if it weren't attached. Thank you for your help. I will speak with Kunon tomorrow. Please help by someone named Geva. Must find her. I'm feeling a bit dry, oh. You! You look thirsty as a flaming fish! You win if you can down it faster than me. Didn't your m There's drinking to be done! Who's with me? I'm looking for Gloucester's elderman. <laughs> well, the one who still draws breath is in the church. How do I get in? You're not supposed to get in. No reason to enter that dump anyway. Fuck, you'd have to get me very drunk to show you inside. Terrible business. Sounds like some air. Loose I came as soon as I heard. Tefter is missing. Murdered. By those visiting dames, no less. It's true what they say. Soulless killers, the lot of them. Have you seen Kunan? <laughs> He's gonna be in the wicker man. Have you seen Kunan? <laughs> the man is it! Oh goodness, you're so frightening! What are you doing after the festival? I'm looking for Kunan. Right! Right, yes, he's in the church. Actually, if you're headed that way, this crate needs to be delivered to him. Just tell Geva I sent you. Of course. Um, what does Geva look like? Badger mask, same as me. Should come running when she sees you. Best of luck, and happy sewing! Geva's waiting for this delivery to the church. That's no way in. Kunan? Oh, for you, love? I could be. Where's Kunan? Mary Lube! Come dance with me! Special delivery. Right, better keep my eyes. Ah, the crate! Yes, yes, come this way. 
Good you came by. Sarah was supposed to drop it off ages ago. Enjoying the festivities. We're done with this shadow play. Tefter's safe, and I know of your plan to sacrifice him in your stead. You think I mean to escape the flames? I go to the Wicker Man gladly, but I will not leave Glowerchester in the hands of the Christian Zealot. Then what? Leave your people without a leader? And an angry church ready with holy fire? They won't be without a leader. Modron will sit upon the Horn's throne. Are you telling me that mother and lied? Ha! <laughs> We've turned you in circles like a dog, haven't we? Moldron was the architect of Tevder's murder, Avar. All to take control of Gloucestershire for herself. It would be a hard grasp to hold, surrounded by Christians on all sides. There was no other way. She had a vision. Tevder framed by flames and burning. Everything we created together. Everything. You and Mother, then Gwynnet? A man must get his house in order before his death. Feather his nest for his children. Your grand scheme has collapsed into sand at every step, Kunin. I know. I never should have trusted Gwilym and his merry band of fuckwits to kill one man. You and the witch? This was the plan. To make me dance your merry tune, so you could build a legacy for your daughter. I always desired Modron. So when she asked me to take the part in a fertility ritual, of course I agreed. Our union conceived not only Gwenev, but a united Glowichestershire. One that Tevder would stamp out. This is where you failed, Kunin. Tevder is a changed man. He straddles the same line as you. Tevder? The boy has the head of a mule. You taught him reason? Not just I. The kindness of bandits and strange Britons. He embraces Christ and churning us alike. Shit. Prophecy is a strange web, is it not? Tevder's reformation just needed a kidnapping and a dedicated Dane. Eivor, Modron will have taken Tevder to her forest temple. If you make haste, you might be able to stay her blade. I have much to attend to here, otherwise I'd lead you myself. Go now. <laughs> Unless you plan on killing me first. Should kill him in the wicker. I want to make sure he doesn't like uh, try to escape, but he. Uh, we should put him in the wicker. Shout out to Jay Smoke, what's up? Uh, I'm wearing a mask, man. Let me see. You are already a dead man. I will not make your people suffer for your actions. Thank you, Eivor. Your mercy will be rewarded, I'm sure. Bamboosh. The gutted lamb. I think chapter four of six, so we have three total missions left. Of course, he's all the way up here in this place. This is where we're going to get that chest that we missed long ago. 
So all I want to do is just get on our horse in GTFOH. Okay, welcome to JSmoke, our uh, our gen mod for the channel. We don't have a lead mod, but JSmoke's the closest one to being one. We uh, currently, yeah. we'll bring those roles back when we have more mods on the channel. But with only three people, it doesn't make sense. So we have a gen mod and two uh, chat mods. Well, actually, I take that back. We also have a Discord mod. So we have four total mods: one gen, two chat, one Discord. Eventually, my plan, yeah, I wouldn't mind throwing another Discord mod on and also uh eventually we'll have to try and move someone up the gen mod and bring on another chat mod or something and we're off yeah you missed out j smoke you would understand why i have this on if you were here man but, yeah. <laughs> now we're doing the story and then uh we came wanted for a murder we didn't do so we're wearing a mask to uh cover our face so that nobody knows it's me the simplest way to put it. Yeah, during the break, I did a post to Insta. I'll have to check, double check it, and then uh, do my stories. I forgot to do that. A few things I'll have to tackle during the break. Attack on sight here. Very like killed everyone here. All right, I gotta go, guys, because my doorbell rang. So uh, I got a package I gotta sign for. BB. I'm back. Man, don't make fun of my bone face character, Jay Smoke. Nice on the lunch, man. I had a. Prior, I mentioned it twice this stream. I went out and got that new bourbon Wendy's double cheeseburger for lunch. I, uh, I was working on the sites in the morning trying to get the new host set up. Having problems, as always, with everything. Everything's always a pain in the ass, you know what I mean? And then uh, 
Went out, grabbed a burger, had to link up with someone to pick something up, and now I'm home, so. Had the burger, got on, and basically was on time, so we're doing uh, 1 to 3.30, then 4 to 6.30, so 5 hours today. Because I can only do 3 tomorrow, due to my class and uh, getting home in the mid-afternoon, so. It'll work out. Out of breath because I had to run, uh, I had to sign for the package. I live in the city, so he'll like drop him on the steps, walk away to go deal with the other houses, and then uh, if I don't, I don't make it by the time he's about to head out, he'll uh, you know pick it up and leave if it's signed for. So thankfully, I called him. He was literally actually walking back towards uh, you know my front door. As I made it, that's how quick they are. You know, they're always fast as hell. That's why we, everyone always misses the damn delivery guys. But thankfully, I got it. Good to go for the weekend, if you know what I mean. Thankfully here we can uh, order by mail. So. Stretch your wings, Sulek. Probably good to go for our Friday, Saturday night streams. Chanting. It's faint. Uh, Jason, well, you're not joining Minecraft, right? So you uh, said you're down for GTA this week. I think we have the full normal crew for GTA. Captain uh, I spoke to in Messenger, he swear he never does, he even cares for Discord anymore. But uh, he said he was going to join, so let me post it now. No, because I don't. I, I literally forgot completely to uh, post that I said I would because he let me know. So. The mother is communing with the gods on this. If it's uh, only me and like Schmag f at Minecraft time, I might cancel it for Tony Hawk as I was saying earlier in the stream. Like, if nobody's caring to join it, might as well just do Tony Hawk this week and then we can bring Minecraft back the week after. Because the third week of the month, which is next week, I'm planning to uh, move Minecraft to Saturday. I'll probably do Hunter Call of the Wild and like Dead by Daylight on Friday night that week and then we can go ahead and do uh, yeah, Minecraft and Fort. Actually, I, th I was going to have to juggle some stuff because I think our Friday... I might have streaming Valhalla on Saturday that week. There's a lot of things I gotta ponder. So I'll figure it out because uh it's gonna be dependent on who can make it. Something is not right. We shall figure it out, I'm not that worried. But yeah, I'll keep you posted. I know J Smoke will be interested in uh being part of our Dude, what are you... That meme is so fucking true that I saw of Assassin's Creed and the guy just completely going the opposite way. I'm, I'm holding out A, which is to climb up and stuff, and he jumps down. Like, what? It's like, where are you going? No, do not climb that wall. It smells like a trap. I should not be seen in this area. It's going to be a busy week tonight. I'm going to work on my Italian class. Tomorrow I'm back in my uh, cybersecurity class on Project Day 2. I got pretty far on Project Day 1, but I got a lot to still do on Project Day 2. We're actually, you know, we had to hack into a machine, try and find flags per se, you know, capture the flag kind of way. There's like four flags you got to hack into. You got to hack into an SQL database. It's a pretty crazy project, but uh, I was already able to get into the database. So that was pretty cool. I was able to get the uh, password for WordPress username and then, yeah, use one of those password... Uh, the cryptos to figure out what it was and log in. So. It wasn't too shabby. I did better than I suspected, that's for sure.
Friday, I'm just gonna chill with Electro Volts. We don't have any more TV shows, so it's more just like chill and hang out Fridays, but uh. Looking forward to Angel Has Fallen with all the drones in it. I don't know if it'll be a good movie or if it's gonna be overly drony, <laughs> if you know what I mean. It's not even a word, but you get the idea. You ever seen Olympus Has Fallen, London Has Fallen, uh, Angel Has Fallen, J Smoke? Or anybody else watching? Chat, it's been really quiet today. So at least we have J Smoke here to hang out for now. Just got notifications on the app that my uh, packages were delivered. It's like, trust me app, I know very well because I had to go get the door. Make sure they wouldn't leave with my stuff. Just stocked up from the uh, the drink store, the adult beverage store. Got myself some Gen Jack, some, uh, I think I got a Merlot, a Cabernet Sauvignon, uh, some Vermouth so I can make some Manhattans for anyone who's uh, 21 plus who drinks cocktails. And I also got myself two mini sakes. They're, uh, you know, it's like rice, Japanese rice wine, or I guess is the best way to put it. I like it with sushi, and I'm going to get sushi next week as part of my uh, celebrating my graduation. So. so this week's a grind. You know, I got the class. The class is going to consume my time Thursday, Saturday. Saturday is going to be long as hell. Four hours of just project grind. I definitely won't be out early that day. I'll guarantee that. Then next Tuesday is my, uh, you know, presentation slash graduation. So. Sweat and blood. Death and birth. Turn this man from beast to earth. Madron, stay your blade, or die at my hand. I should have known Kunon wouldn't have it in him to quarter you for the dogs. It's a cold bitch who throws her lover to the wolves for her own crimes. You understand so little. No matter. Let me enlighten you with the fury of the gods. We're gonna fight? Man, where's she gonna fight me from up there? Take this! <laughs> she I'm such a high level. It's kind of a joke that she's even trying to fight me. Don't shoot, let her burn. Die, mother. Or is she running up there? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, you cheap motherfucker, you. Man. Alright, so you're gonna pay a fucking hefty price for rehealing like that, because I have no so I have absolutely no respect in any re you know, view of this at all, of any in-game character that heals himself on a boss fight. Get the fuck back here. We're gonna teach you a fucking lesson. Come here. Stop trying to run away. You're gonna pay a price for that. You ain't gonna avoid death. Yeah, run all you like. I'm coming for you. time again for me like that. Die. Thought she was going to keep moving. Don't you even dare think about going up here to heal. Don't you even dare think about it. 
I've had enough of your shit. So you're gonna pay the price. And that's gonna be it, alright? Whack me all you like. Your time has come. Gloucestershire in the hands of that Christian, and for what? Your name and some trade routes? Do you doubt the power of your guards to sway the mind of a man? Tefter is no longer the seller you believe him to be. A man will lie to save his skin. When you are gone, he'll gut me and burn my people. The gods showed me this. Kunan spoke of your vision. The Nordnir spin their fatal threats, but without your plan, his heart would remain unchanged. Then I have no regrets. But I had a vision of you as well. One of a path that twists like the river owls. The seer's spinnings twist limb and word alike. Prophecy is a river, and we are powerless to fight its clutches. She was fighting to protect her people. But she ground your name to dust. Sullied the honor of herself and her people. So it's a major decision right here. Shout to Soso Gamer. What is up? Welcome to the stream. I was focused on the fight, so I uh, figured to answer chat after the battle. So we gotta make a decision here. We're either going to kill Modron or spare. So the question relating to the story, this is a major question. So, uh, spoiler alert. If you decide to kill after the fight, her daughter Gwynedd will come into the room and see you kill her mom. They'll say that he will see that she is cared for because she has no guilt in the situation. If you spare, the girl will walk inside and hug her mom happily. It's pretty much the outcome. Blah, blah, blah. It won't change the relationship, so it's purely a choice. At least this one side. I feel like it would have a an outcome. The answer chat, I'm going for like the best outcome possible, but I don't think this affects it, so I probably would like to kill her. There's no reason to keep her alive. Just, I always double check, especially on major uh, decisions. One second. Yeah, I'm not gonna spare. I cut my own path. <laughs> she tried to murder me. I mean, honestly, why would you spare her in the first place? What sorcery happened here? The High Priestess Modron tried to kill you. Why? In God's name, I've done nothing to her. She feared the charge would use you as God's hammer. So she convinced Kunan to have you killed. I killed Modron, but Kunan lives to burn in the Wicker Man. Such a waste of life. The devil whispers into the ear of man. But we must ignore his voice. Modron had a vision of you wiping out the pagans. Gwyneth is Kunan's bastard, so he simply did it to protect his kin. Love for one's child is a virtue, but wrath is a sin. How can one entangle with the other? We all lose our heads when our legacy is threatened. Be that name, kingdom, or child. Now, what of the witchling? I'll see that she's cared for. She has no guilt in this. I will not join your Church of Christ! You won't have to. Calm down, little girl. Mommy go night-night forevers. <laughs> we'll make sure Mama is doing alright in here, alright? Let's 
part of the ritual. Oh god, there's <laughs> they're in the flames. You guys alright? He doesn't look alright. He looks like he might have uh he might have got hurt. <laughs> Burning of the wicker man. I think we're on chapter five or six maybe for this area. My goal is to play till three thirty. At two and a half hours, thirty minute break. And then another two and a half hours today, so. I've been keeping these even. It's all the way back down here. After this, we only have uh, Hamptonshire, which has two missions, but a ton of uh, stuff to collect. Then we have the northern part of uh, Norway, which I don't think has that much stuff. It's just higher level, which only has like two missions. And then we have Vinland, which is spoiler, but it's not really because the game's been out and the DLC is already hitting. But uh, I think it's the final location where we get the final kill the final person or something like that from what I saw online. So I was looking at our plan. My goal is to get this game done for 100% hopefully by end of next week. I don't know if it's possible or not, but we'll, we're still going to grind for it because uh, then we have the DLC to tackle as well. And then I'm going to go back for Watch Dogs Legion as we kind of left that game up in the air. Guna, it's good to see a face I trust. Even your frightful mug. I thought this could be our shared saga, but it is time to leave. We have spent not but a drink together. Worry not, Eivor. You and I have many tales to tell yet. And our names ring out clear and with honor. Yeah, a tale. A tale of Gloucester. Beautiful land, full of damned fools. Ha! I will drink to that. You have my thanks. Anything for you, old friend. Then let us say our farewells to this wicker king. And then be on our way home. Yes. Ranvi will be eager to meet Richard. Richard and Gunnar have already gone ahead. There it is. Let's go burn this mother flarper. I, I kept him alive to make sure he burns in this. So let's get him inside. So I don't like him. <laughs> get in there. Get in there now. Tell me, please. What of Moulton? Dead and burned on a pyre, much like this one. <laughs> I didn't think. I hoped you would spare her at least. Grant. Please don't do it! We can burn something else! Someone else! This is the best for your journey, little one. You got two psycho parents. Let them go. <laughs> that grows the trees and the barley. My body feeding the gods. Worms. And even you. So I will be here. And a long, long time from now. When you're old and wrinkled like an apple. <laughs> you will see me again. Father. I thought I could be ready. Hey, le legit. Her dad wants to burn in this fucking fire, and then her mom was a crazy ass witch lady. I mean, it's probably for the better that she, uh, you know, gets it is time. gets out of there. <laughs> Make sure she finds a nice home. Then it doesn't turn out like mama. Is yours. This is your path, Tifter. No thorns and briars could keep you from it. And you, Avor, friend of Gloucestershire, you have lived up to your reputation. I know you owe me less than nothing, but please, take care of them. I take no pleasure in the suffering of others. You would know this if you had given me a chance.
Twenty years I have been your elderman. Now these old bones are ready for my last duty. I have worked alongside you. Clearing fields, brewing drink, births, and deaths. All growing and learning. The wicker man is ready, O oh king. Your altar awaits. I am honored to be your harvest king. With this flame set, may our crops be plentiful and our winters brief. Despite it all, he has the ending he prayed for. Straight to the mouths of hungry gods. I would just stand up in this room and die. Oh my god, we get to kill him. The honor is yours. God, the honor is mine, guys. How do I want to do this? I have explosives. Is there like explosive barrels or something? Why does Kunan have to go? He's saving us all now. Where's the arrows? Man, I can't do this without arrows. Who didn't bring us arrows? You some bitches. You sent me out to kill a bunch of people and then don't give me arrows. I, ca I can't leave up here. How do I do this? I can't do it. I don't have arrows. <laughs> uh, Alright, we got the torch. Alright, I'll take it back. I was kind of worried for a second. I was like, what the hell? Goodbye. You're an idiot, and that's why I'm gonna try to throw this right in your window. Hey -ya! <laughs> The screams of an idiot who decides that he should burn inside of there. Damn, look at that. I get a screenshot of this, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're all so happy about this dude burning. <laughs> all for the crops. Oh God, is that him? Accept this offering! <laughs> Take of me my flesh and bone and flesh! <laughs> Bless my As horrible as it was, it's just funny at this point because he's an idiot and he fucking climbed in there. <laughs> Can't feel sorry for him, you know what I mean? Well, there you go, guys. We did it. We finished the story. We're so fucking early. We were supposed to be getting... Uh, I think we were supposed to be starting this region today according to my previous schedule for the next two weeks for this game. Just tackling... I think we were supposed to just start tackling and complete this region today. Like between today and tomorrow, we're gonna be we're already done the region a whole day and a half early. This region only has two missions, but a shit ton of stuff to do. But we can do that probably the rest of today. All this little stuff. Then we have the northern part of Norway, which can't take more than a, a session. Then we have Vinland, which can't take that long. So we're pretty damn close. Then we have the achievements. That's gonna be the most tedious part. Mopping up some of those achievements are pain in the ass. Some of them are a legit pain in the ass. So we'll get to that at some point. But uh. River to Raid, something they added on. I might check it out. But uh, I'm in no rush. And then we got Lost Glory. You want to go for that. Eventually we got to go. Let's, when we, let's go back uh, to Ravensthorpe. And what we're going to do is take a moment to uh, turn some stuff in as well. Got a lot of Roman artifacts and so forth we can turn in and see what we get out of it. I was also thinking about upgrading my bow. 
Heard there's a better bow available at the store, possibly. Here's where we can turn the stuff into this dude. So stop real quick. I'm grateful to see Bassem returned. There's so much more I wish to learn from him. Oh no. Nope. Apparently we can't give him any of those. Oh no no, we gotta give the don't we give the Roman artifacts to someone on the other side? We have not stepped foot in this area for a while, so I might as well take a second uh Go around real quick. I also think we might be able to build some new buildings that are uh, incomplete. Hello? Anybody here? Here you are. More relics for your collection. Hmm. What have you brought for me? Wonderful. And here is... Roman Bass Statue Scheme. I could use more artifacts like this. Here you are. More relics for your collection. Show me what you found. Wonderful. And here is something for you. There's a room gladiator like statue. Out there. Bonum fortunum in your travels, Eivor. Survey the area, Sunan. Let's go build a few things and I'll go figure out what we're doing next. I have a feeling with the rest of this half hour before I take a half hour break we'll go ahead and uh, start probably exploring Hamptonshire. The final region in all of England that I gotta complete. I've completed absolutely everything there is to do in everywhere else. There's an extended storyline that begins here, Lost Glory, but we're not doing that right now. We've already completed the region, but that's on, uh, on top of completing the region they apparently added a mission. But, uh, yeah, last region is right here, plus then northern Norway and Vinland. So if I calculate right, we should be able to get this area done between today and tomorrow. Finish northern Norway probably uh, on Thursday. Get done Vinland slash maybe the rest of the game next week. Then the week after that, the final week of the month, we have an event going on in Star Citizen for everyone who's interested in that. But on top of that, I'll uh, start the DLC for this game as well. I got more than enough building supplies, apparently. So. And there's an achievement for placing stuff at every uh, spot, too. So I'll have to try to do that. Every spot you can put stuff in the village, you gotta put something. <sighs> Damn! Carrie's house. Hey, what? It's Swanborough. Hello. Swanborough, you made it. Swanborough. Did. I should send a letter to Hunwell to give him the news. Oh, you know how he frets over me. He misses you, that is certain. But as elderman, he cannot afford to let his grief overpower him. I pray he fares well. I adore the lad, but I worry the burden will be too great. He should be fine. He has the heart of a leader. Now come, settle in and enjoy your new home. What do I think of your sign? Here, we'll build your house. I'm going around being you know, very nice to the people of my town. Damn, look at her crib. Ball and you just need to put in a second floor up in there. Ooh, a spot to put decorations. It's got quite a few new things. Roman Olympian statue. Do 
Does this need to be built? It's already a damn building here. What else do you need? Does <laughs> is it me or does it not look much different? I don't know. Whatever. So who else needs building around here? That's the real question. Is everything built? Bakery needs to go up. Cattle farm needs to go up. That's what we just did, though. You upgraded more than once? I'm so confused. More expansions they need on this cattle farm, man. Holy shit, look, it's it's coming along. Oh, I think it's done. Damn. Alright, so it did change drastically. <laughs> I wasn't sure for a sec. I was like, man. There, I got something there. And building complete. But we can also upgrade it even more, apparently. I think we completed it. We're almost to level 6 on the village, which means we'll uh, be maxed out pretty soon. I also have to put, like I said, uh, decorative stuff at every spot. So I'm just taking a second to do this stuff. It's part of my playthrough. I might as well look around while we're here already. But I will get back to this, yeah, the main story in a moment. We have a nice chunk of achieves that still go, so you know, we'll work our way there. I figured next week would be more of the achievement grind, you know, just get the uh, stuff done that we haven't gotten done yet. I don't think we can build anything else than this, so once we build this, this is probably all I can do. For now, at least. We gotta do some more raids. Okay. Then one more stuff. So we gotta finish this and we have the bakery, but we're getting pretty close to six out of six, so. Let me just clear these codex. Alright, let's go report, guys. Let's see where we're going next. I have a feeling it's the final region, I mean. There's literally only three other regions in the game, one of them not being given to me until later on in the story, until like the end of the story is the best way to put it, so. Here's another decorative spot I haven't utilized. What the hell's this? Cozy fire. That's perfect, man. Right here. Right outside there. It's perfect. Here's another spot that's vacant. That's why I'm just quickly running around. We're probably missing something else, and I'm not going to spend a half hour looking for it, but... And no achievement, meaning we didn't put something in every spot yet so far. Are there any spots across that river? I think there is, right there on the right. Over here, put a berserker bear totem. That's where that river mission is, but we're not trying to do that right now. How many more spots for this stuff are there? That I somehow didn't reach yet. There's another one right here on the left. No wonder we don't have the achievement. Jeez Louise. It's down by the water. Let's put a nice guardian lamp. It's a cool concept because it's right on the water front. And... Ah, uh, I thought I got... My phone and my uh, watch go off before the Xbox gives me achievements, so I'll, like... You know, when I'm about to get an achievement, I'll know before you guys see it on screen. Just from my alerts on my phone and stuff. Hello. 
So, for a second I thought it was coming. Here's another one. They aren't joking. They say these are all over. Traditional Yule Garland. How many more spots are there? <laughs> what the f Am I really missing more? Really don't have any idea where else there could be stuff. Apparently we need to do Maida's house too. Maida. Maida. Alright, let's see. Is there like somehow something back here, far back on the road maybe? Not trying to waste much more time on this, but uh... Is there anything back here? That's the real question. I don't think so. Yeah. Obviously we're missing one or two or however many because the achievement didn't unlock. I have no idea where they would be. We've already like run around all over here. There's probably one in some weird spot that you would never guess hey that we'll have to like oh, figure right. out later. Let's go continue on here because we're right out front. First, I'm going to check my mail. You don't got mail. Alright, so that's good enough. Let's go back. Figure out what's going on next in the story. I can hardly begin to describe what happened in Gloucestershire. I think you will learn soon enough. But we are allied with them. Yes. For all our pains. Boom. I want to see the Alliance map. There's nothing to do on the Alliance map anymore. They're all completed. I'm about to just start grinding Hamptonshire anyway, right now. I have changed my mind. There's no reason for me to talk to you. There's nothing I can do. I should go. So the story is kind of just hinting that I have to push on. I wanted to go and start the Hamptonshire region, but we're about 20 minutes from the break. Let's just go do this mission then. It makes more sense to come all the way up here and tackle this real quick. I don't know why we can't fast travel right now, though. Let's try again. We already completed this region, so I'm not too sure why we have to go back up here. Alright, why is fast travel an available game? I mean, come on. It's not rocket science, it's a simple... Oh, let's go Sigurd's an asshole. <laughs> oh, here we go. Reap what was sown. Okay, so that's why it wouldn't let me fast travel. Was trying to introduce me. Oh god, it scared me for a second. I was like, I got all these new missions, but we didn't. We this is the one I was talking about going to, but now we also have a new one here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull up the list for missions real quick, and I'm gonna kind of spoil it for you guys. So if you don't care for spoilers, now's the prime time to step away for like a minute while I uh. Take a look at the mission list for the game. The, the game's been out for like half a year, right? So I don't think it's a big deal if I uh, discuss what's to come. But right now I'm just trying to check the uh, the storyline. So for Yervik Shire, this is the official last mission. So let's do that first. For Hordafilk, the final region of Norway, there's only two missions where legends are born and a brother's keeper. For Hamptonshire, there's only two kingdoms end in Holy Day. We have a mission called uh, Reap What Was Sown. Where the hell does this fit in on the list? Vinland has three missions as well. Let me see. Reap. Let 
I don't think it's a actual full out mission. I think it's just a visitor. It's not showing up on the main mission list as like an official mission. Well, let's go see what they want. Uber Ragnarsson, you are a long way from your king's side. Eivor. Yes, a long stroll through the hills and fields of Mercia. Also, I could thank you. Thank me? For sending my brother to his just reward. In spite of the harm he caused you and everyone around you, I could not keep him in line in this life. But I have no doubt the old father will put him to good use in the next. A darkness followed your brother. One I'm not sure he understood. But as you say, he is now where he belongs. He is. And as a show of my thanks, I came to offer you a gift. A token of my respect. Thank you. Put it to good use, Wolfkist. And may we meet again soon. On a battlefield if the fates are kind. Well, that was, uh... That's why it's not considered a main mission. <laughs> In and out. What, he gave me a mastery point? Alright, so... Back to our quest line. River of the Raid was like an add-on, like a DLC quest line, I think, just so you would have something to do. I have to look it up and see if there's an actual mission to this. Or if, uh... If River Raids are just... Something that you do forever, I have no idea, but we'll have to check those out as well at some point, but... Seems like Lost Glory is where we should be going right now. So unless the game forces me to stay, we're heading out. Let's do this mission, then I'm going to go and break, because I'm about 15 minutes from the planned break. But uh, we're playing two and a half hours, a 30 minute break, and another two and a half hours. If we play like two hours 45, then we take a 30 minute break, then we do two hours 15. Or even if we do, uh, you know, three and two, I don't really care. Let's just keep trucking a little bit. When I say I'm taking breaks, they're always, you know, subject to change. There's always, you know, motions that can take place, and I definitely don't mind doing that for you guys. Let's just keep this truck, and I don't want to ditch out yet. But when we come back, we do have, like I said, two regions. I have Vinland's, the we'll have to do that. Vinland's probably last. We'll be doing the missions and the completion of the region of Vinland absolutely last, but, uh... Hamptonshire is probably the region I'll do next. Even if the mission story doesn't lead there, I might go down there and just start tackling the Wealth Mysteries artifacts because it's the official last region of here. I thought about knocking it out for here in Norway, then doing the story. I'm not sure what I'll do, but Hamptonshire only has two missions, like I said, so it's more so a grind of the, the area than it is an actual elongated storyline. And there's only three missions of Vinlid and only two back in the other region, so that's why I'm saying I feel like we're going to be done the game well before I expect it. I was planning two days, as in two entire afternoons per region. And we are a day and a half ahead, like I said already. And we're beyond a day and a half ahead because we're already done with Gloucestershire. So, I was supposed to be finishing Gloucestershire today and then, uh... Oh no, starting Gloucestershire today and finishing it tomorrow and then starting the next region. Or something like that, so... I forget, we talked about it earlier in the week and last week. But uh, we're well ahead of plans, all I gotta say. Even though we have more than I planned, we're still ahead of plan, so it's nice. So I really want to get to the DLC. The DLC looks awesome, plus it might be massive as hell as well, so... Moira, is something wrong? Weep for Northumbria. Is it Hafton? Has he gotten worse? His heart is broken. He's a mere shadow of himself. With Faravid lost and his brothers away, he wallows in paranoia and sadness. I could speak with him. Where is he now? Wandering the fields of Pitteringa with his beloved Bayonton. I'll find him. Thank you, Moria. Pitteringa is in the east. Just we need our glorious Hafton back. Man, Hafton, where are you going, man? I had to come all the way back up here just to like regain your glory and have a chat with you or something. Might be in Pitteringa. I don't know where the fuck Pitteringa is, so let's find out. <laughs> Pitteringa. There's a tower. This fucking area is huge, so it's. Piscantoon or whatever the hell that said. Where's Pitcheringa? Pitcheringa, hello. Where are you? Oh shit, there it is. I'm blind as a bat. So we gotta go up here. Yeah, with uh, 11 minutes left, let's just say if we get this mission done within 10 minutes, I'm gonna take the break on normal time. If we need an extra 10 minutes, I'll stay the extra 10. Let's just at least go and break with a uh, flat. 
thing because this is the final mission for this region and it's after the main story here apparently so you guys get the idea my dog just uh entered the room he just got back from his walk so He's probably like, why aren't you going on break? I was in here to scavenge the floor even though I haven't been eating anything in here. Man, what are you looking That's all my dog does. Scavenge for food even when there's no food. So J Smoke, uh, I don't know why I'm. Let me turn off that damn side marker because it's taking me to the wrong spot. Uh, yeah. It's been a very long game, man. I'm like, when we, when we uh, take the break, I'll pause. You guys will see I'm at like 140F an hour. This is the longest Assassin's Creed I've ever played. We can play Assassin's Creed 1, 2, Brotherhood, and I think Revelations. All four original games in the time it took to beat this game. Maybe even less. I plan to stream those someday. Uh, I have the original. I'm thinking about streaming. I might stream AC 1 over the summer. I might stream the original Torok. Cruise in USA. Cruise in Exotica. I mean, I'd love to play like Pokemon Red or something, but uh, we have to test out the cartridges and then the batteries are a problem, so there's a lot to think about. But the older stuff is a risk. That's why I want to finish Super Mario 64, because uh, I'm living on a battery from like the late 90s, so... If we lose our save, it would absolutely destroy everything we spent all that time to get done. So we should probably finish it just in case the battery goes. That's going to be the first game I go back to complete. No glory, no. Depending how long the DLC is, though, I might, you know, I'm either going to grind the DLC and only the DLC, or I'm going to consider doing, uh, you know, Valhalla Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, or something, then do uh, Legion Fridays or something like that as we go into June. But no decisions officially. So we can do the same for Super Mario. We can. Uh, while we're doing Legion, tackle that, but I went to one game at a time. We used to play this in Legion. It was just too much work. Too many different games at one time, especially because uh, once I'm done this, we're officially done all the new games of the year. We get Mass Effect Legendary, I think tomorrow or in two days it comes out, but that's on my list of future possibilities. It's like over 100 hours to beat all three original games with DLC, so I'm in no interest to hop into another 100 plus hour grind after this, but my goal is to play a bunch of little stuff, whether it's on Xbox, throwbacks. You know, I have a... Uh, just to show you guys, I'm not going to take long, but I have... Most of these games are free from gold and blah, blah, blah. But I have 313 games. It also includes all my old... Yeah, I'll show you right here. AC1. We have uh, AC... Where is it? The Ezio Collection, which is two Brotherhood Revelations, all remastered. We have the third remastered. So the only one we'll be playing that's not remastered is the original Assassin's Creed. I will probably go for a full 1K on that. We also have the non-remastered, you know, versions of these games, I think, right? Or no, we don't, actually. I didn't install those, but we had, uh... Hey, Brotherhood's right here. Where the hell's Revol... Oh, it's right here, sorry. So they are there. I just don't have AC2 installed. What the hell? I thought I had AC2 installed, but, you know, you can see I have Rogue, Syndicate. Yeah, it's, it's... I also thought of playing these Chronicle games for you guys, but they're different. They're not the same. I w thought about replaying Black Flag. I just figured I'd show you guys. We have just too many games. I probably don't have enough time in my lifetime to play all the games I want to do, let alone yeah, this and that. So we'll, we'll pick and play over the summer. It might even be Fable 1. I actually forgot to make a note on my phone of this stuff. Uh, so give me a sec, and then we'll talk to this guy. Because so I was going to do Fable 1 solo, then Fable 2 and 3 with Electrovolts co-op. I was going to do... Uh, there was Turok I mentioned. There's obviously SM64. There's always, you know, the Pokemon games. All right, sorry about that, but uh, Stand just so I don't forget. Captain. I'm taking you back to Jorvik. <laughs> Up, my lord. You're a king. You're not allowed to sulk. Men bled and died to sit you on that throne. So go sit. My brother, Ivar. Did he die well? He died fighting. 
You slew my brother and never said a word. You kept this from me. It was no secret. Up and you. Did he not... Leave me. I will not. I've come to see you safely home. Now get up. I... I mislaid my hammer. I think Beonton ran off with it, but I'm not... I'm not... Uh, I'm not well, Eivor. I'll find your hammer. And then you'll come with me. I was on my way to Scarborough. If you find my hammer, bring it to me there. Find and retrieve half dance hammer. Let's go. Well, yeah, you guys saw what's up. I yeah, if you guys ever wanted me to, I could always make a video showcasing my collection or doing the ramp chat. For anyone who hasn't seen it though, I do have videos of our achievements and those are the videos where I discuss games. Like I go through a list of like over a few hundred games I think on the first achievement video I did. In like, an, in like almost an hour and a half or something or whatever it was. And we talk about how I reached, uh, one video goes from 0 to 100,000 gamer score. So I start from the bottom of the list and go back from my original days on Xbox all the way through uh, yeah, reaching 100k. Then I had a video for 100k to 111111. The video after that was 123456. Each of these videos I only talk about the difference. So I, when I do 125,000, you know, 123456 gamer score. I talked about you know one 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 to well to one two three four five six, from one two three four five six I jumped to one hundred fifty thousand, I think it was so uh, yeah one hundred fifty thousand. Talked about the difference there, blah blah blah. I have quite a few of those videos. My next one's two hundred thousand. If we click the middle button, I'm at one hundred eighty thousand six hundred eighty one. Games like this are the reason that I'm uh, taking so long to get there, but. We're going to grind, we're going to get there. We're going to jump off with the wolf, he'll die, but we'll survive. There's Bjornsson, guarding the hammer. I wasn't joking. Rip. Half drunk needs his hammer. Oh, hold on, he's in Scarborough, which is all the way down over here. So we're officially three minutes from the break. We're not even over the break. We might actually get on the break right at the break time, which will be you know perfect in a way. So I won't complain. A few things I want to do during the break, but uh, the light I sold something online. I want to go box up some stuff like that, but I should be back after 30 minutes and we'll play two and a half because 6.30, I, I got 100% caught at 6.30 because, you know, I ain't no exercise, you know, I ain't no crazy exercise person or anything, but uh, I've been talking about since the pandemic started. I went from being, you know, lazy, you know, nice and uh, chunky per se, you know, eating way too many fast food and been exercising the whole year, so this ain't trying to lose it. To That's about it. Remember that next time. <laughs> My father, Ragnar, he gifted this to me. Took it off a Finnish chief. Still warm with blood when he handed it to me. I had 14 winters. Ragnar Lothbrok was a great king. Finnish arrow killed my mother. A shield maiden she was. As fierce as a wolf swallowing the sun. My father swore to kill the men who took her from us. And he did. Fourteen against one. But that was years ago in the east. And this is the west, where my father lies dead. A pile of bones in a pit of snakes. And here we are, still telling stories of his life and deeds. How did my brother die?
Uh, we should probably look up this decision. So here's our choices. I want to see if uh, it's going to have any major repercussions. Just give me one sec. We only have about four major decisions to go. I just realized if this list is anything correct, guys. That's crazy. We're that close to the end. But uh, I'm using the uh, Gamer's Heroes guide. It's pretty good. So, spoiler alert. If you tell him die to warrior, half them will say he's glad and ask you to light the fire top of the tower. Half them will later thank you and tell you you're always welcome in his hole. If you die to coward, half them you tell Halftan you killed him. Halftan says that Ivar did that. He did indeed deserve death. Halftan will later say thank you and tell you that you're always welcome in his hole. I feel like he needs... Uh, I forget. Which one was he? It's been a while since we... Is he the guy who was an asshole? He's a crazy fucker. Eva murdered an innocent man. A good man. He earned the death I gave him. Hmm. If the codes of honor demanded his death, he did what had to be done. Phaeton, my boy! <laughs> Come here, boy! A dog always forgives, but he needs you home. All of Northumbria does. <clears throat> Do a last thing for me. Light the beacon for all to see, and let it burn. Where's the beacon? How oh, good we climb all the way up there. <laughs> hey guys, once I do this and the mission is officially done, I'm not going to waste much time to going into a save and going on my brain. Should be a full 30 minutes from whatever we end. I'm tired of telling, you know, we'll hit like 335 and I keep being like, oh, it's cool, I'll still come back at 4, we're not going to do that anymore. Because every t half the time I do that, I end up coming back at the 30 minute mark. So, you know, instead of cutting my break short, we'll just go minute per minute or round up a few minutes. I'd rather come back early than be late. That's our new motto. So if I know I'm going to be back in 20 minutes, but I'm not 100% set, I'll tell you guys 30. I'll come back in 20 if I can, and that'll be how the cookie crumbles. So I might come back early, but no guarantees. We'll, uh, you know, let life decide. Quest complete. Lost the glory. It leaves me with absolutely nothing to do in the game. <laughs> but uh, I'm pretty sure from here, guys, if I was to explain really quick what's going to happen. One, we got to tackle Hamptonshire and do the two missions there. Two, we got to tackle the uh, northern region of Norway and the two missions there. And three, we got to tackle Vinland and the three missions there. We are so effing close to done. It's not. I can like taste the end of the game. And, and as weird as that sounds, that's like, it's just, it's that fucking close. It's that close. But, uh, achievement-wise, you know, we'll get this by, you know, this I think we'll get by completing the three regions. This we may or may not get by doing that. I was going to do all the treasure hoard. I don't know if I will officially decide to do them all or not. I think there's only like 20 of them, so I, if I'm going to, I'll just look up a map and we'll, uh, we'll fast travel and just have random chat while I do it. We gotta beat all the Orlog players, so this is gonna be fucking stupid, but there's like 19 Orlog players or something, so I gotta make a list and then literally go to each place following a strategy I found for winning Orlog each time, and it'll be torture, but we'll have to do that. This will be easy, we just gotta slide in the snow, I'm sure you know, there's a place to do it. We gotta do that. That shouldn't be too bad. All Territories was the biggest grind to achieve in the game, in my view, so I'm still working on that. That's what we're doing now by completing the regions. We have to ram and destroy five boats in under two minutes with our longship. We have to reach settlement level six. Each uh, cosmetic spot, that's what I was trying to do earlier. Catch each type of fish in the game, which is apparently rarer than completing everything else. Complete all the flightings. Yeah, we'll have to do all this. All these secret achieves, I'm pretty sure, are story related for the most part. Other than, uh, I think one of them relates to the order. So we'll have to kill everybody in the order, too. There's a lot. As much as it seems like we're close to the end, we're not that close. That's what I hinted at earlier. I feel like I can touch it, but we cannot just yet. I've beat, uh, I did on stream, I think, what, Unity Syndicate, 
Arjun's Odyssey Valhalla. This has been the longest, the most tedious, the most grindy of them all. I thought Odyssey was bad with its massive map, but this game is, is above Odyssey at this point. We did over 200 hours on Odyssey, but we did all the DLCs. Multiple seasons of DLCs, so it was like impossible not to. Plus, we did everything the game had to offer. Every side mission, every main mission. Pretty much everything I set except the, uh, the hidden treasures. And I skipped those because when I went to do them, they were utter garbage. And there was no point to uh, finding them in that game. In this game, I'm probably going to consider doing the treasures because uh, if you look... There's not that many. But yeah, sorry to anyone who might be tuning in. I'm going to head on my break. We did uh, two and a half hours, a 30 minute break, and two and a half hours more today. This is all there is for treasures. And uh, in Odyssey, there was like 500 of these. But this is all there is here. So what we'll do is I'll honestly probably just look up a map online that'll be like, here's where all the treasures are. Go get them. And that's what we'll do. But I think it's time for a break. I definitely need one. We're going to take a full 30 minutes from when I close out. So let's do this and I'll tell you guys when I'm returning after we're done. We're 141 hours in. If we can get Hamptonshire done, we're looking at 150 to 160, if I'm not mistaken. We still have tomorrow. We have uh, two and a half hours more today, three hours tomorrow. That's why I'm doing a whole extra hour today because we're losing it tomorrow. I didn't want to lose that time, so I uh, you know, mitigated it. Then we're not doing Valhalla again until Monday, and then next Monday through Thursday is fully dedicated to Valhalla. Monday will be a normal day, 1.30 till 6. I might even get on early and end late. Tuesday I have class, so it has to be 1 to 5.30. My final class, my graduation day, so obviously I'm not going to friggin' push the limit on that one. But next Wednesday I'm officially done the class. We can officially just, even next Thursday, there's no more bullshit of uh, getting off 5.30 for class like I will after tomorrow. So uh, starting next Wednesday we're going to go to... Uh, more free scheduling again. My goal is going to be 1.30 to 6 every day. Week, Monday through Saturday, 1.30 to 6. But some days we might get on early and end late. You know, we can always extend the streams a little bit. Within the next month or two is when I'm going to have the most flexibility in the last, like, year. Because then I'm going to look for a, a position after the class. And if I get a position, we're going to lose, like, three, four streams a week. While it sounds detrimental, if I'm caught up on this in Legion, it won't really affect the schedule much other than probably what I do on the side for fun. Like those pop-up streams like I'm doing of uh, Tony Hawk Pro Skater and Rainbow Six Vegas 2. Like, we'll skip those and it'll make the difference. So that's going to be that for that. Uh, here's the notification of the DLC, but it's not out yet. I don't want to bore you guys anymore or keep ranting on. So let's go over our supporter screen and I'll give you guys a return time. Special thanks to our supporters. BFG Weekly Vlogs all the way across the board. Same with J-Smoke. J-Smoke's here right now. And shout out to BVT on Patreon membership. Camp Sir, Shark Comp on Super Chat. Appreciate the support, guys. It means a lot. Otherwise, uh, let's go ahead and put up our intermission screen while I close out my remarks here. So I'm going to post in chat. TGF's intermission starts now. Returning roughly 4.05 p.m. ET. I'm, I'm cutting two minutes on myself. whoop de doo I'll, I'll survive that. I'm not going to put 4.07. We'll just say 4.05. But if I come back 4.07, don't kill me because I might take the full 30. But uh, I'll see you guys around 30 minutes out. We're going to stay live for the intermission. Come back to an entire other two and a half hours about. So five hours of game time today. Absolutely effing crazy. I still got uh, half of my energy drink can ready to go for the second half. So I'll see you guys after the break. Peace out.
Hello, and welcome to a continuation of the TGS Assassin's Creed Valhalla Series X live stream. That is a continuation of number 40 to be exact. We're going to be playing for quite some more time, and uh, we'll kind of cover all that in this mini re-intro, and uh, we'll go from there. I was just joking with that weird intro, but just want to say I'm sorry. I, uh, I think I took like a 32 minute break. So, uh, yeah, it is what it is. I'm not going to sweat it. Two-minute loss on a five-hour five hour plus a 30-minute break session you know, it is, I'd say, negligible at that point. So, especially being so far ahead, I doubt that two minutes will change our entire lives. Shout out to Jay Smoke. What is up, man? So, uh, plan for the day was to play this back-to-back. -back. We did one to three, like, 37. Now we came back uh, like 4.09 or something, so like I said, 32 minutes. And we're going to play till about 6.30, so we got about 2 hours and 20 minutes to go. Plenty of time to get a shit ton done in this game. As for the game itself, our goal is to uh, continue on, so I just got done the mission uh, up in this region. Not sure if another mission is going to pop up or how it's going to work, but I figured this is one of the last three areas we got to tackle, so... Other than achievements, tackling the rest of the order, you know, finding a few things, doing kills a certain way, you know, whatever else random stuff we got to do. Our main focus on top of the missions and all too is uh, to do these regions as well. We have Hamptonshire, the northern part of Norway to do, as well as uh, the third region, Vinland, which we'll get later on. So uh, I figured for now we can spend the rest of today's session seeing if we can hammer this out because if we can get this done tomorrow we'll pretty much have one region to tackle which I might just uh we can even go there right now and get it done if we really wanted to uh let's just travel there I'm on series x so it shouldn't take long but uh either way it's, that's all that's left so I'm gonna try and get this game done full 1k by end of next week do the dlc over the course of the, like the last week of the month into june Go back to Legion, and then hopefully get to a bunch of old school content. Like I said, like Super Mario 64, other N64 games, Torok Original, uh, the original Fable. There's a ton of games I would love to stream, so uh, we'll definitely be bringing those on at some point. Either way, you guys can see, there's nothing in Fornberg, and we've completed everything in this region. Some spots that are still covered, but uh, I'd say they're negligible. Moving up here, that's all there is in this region. So I'm about to just go do it now. We have uh, two wealth. Well, five mysteries and two artifacts. And then we obviously have some chests here and there. So I'd say... Let's go here. We'll go one, two, three. From there we can head to here. From there we can work our way to here into the city, tack all of this, head over to here. There's nothing else further up there, so then from there we can travel to here, up through this island, go through, through there, up through there, and eventually making our way back up into here. So I haven't been to Norway in a while, this wasn't even part of my thoughts today, but uh, part of our playthrough requires the only two remaining accessible regions I gotta tackle are this and the uh, Hampton Shire. And we've been on England this entire time, so I figured let's come back and do this real quick. And then we can go back and probably start with Hampton Shire today, finish it tomorrow. And that would just leave a total of five missions plus completing Vinland left for uh, next week at that point, which is 100% capable, you know, possible. So I think we're on par for our full completion of the game, which will be amazing. But uh, I can't speak too soon. We gotta hustle, we gotta go, we gotta be fast. There's no BS time. It's going to be 2 hours and 20 minutes of grind. For anyone interested though, this is in our final Valhalla of the week. We have it tomorrow from 3 to 6 with no intermission. And then that's it for the week. But next uh, Monday through Thursday, we'll be playing this again. I'm going to sacrifice the wolves live to land down here. Sorry, buddy, but... Uh, usually you don't die. That was the first time I've ever died with the wolf. <laughs> uh, I think that was a little bit too high. Usually you just take some damage. I did not realize how uh, far we were going to fall. I'm not unfortunately Spider-Man, so I can't just swing up, but... Hey, we're a little bit high up. We should probably use caution going down there. Might have to just climb down the old school way. <laughs> that was stupid as hell. Yeah, we'll have the uh, DLC to tackle as well, so that's going to take forever too, I'm guessing. 
So we've been on this game for quite some more time, but uh, we're going to keep grinding to get the same pattern into June if need be. I'm not sure how long the DLC will be, but we'll probably start finding out within the next few days. So I'm pretty sure it releases tomorrow or the 14th or something. So. Oh god, look at that fall. We should probably uh, try to avoid falling here. But, uh, what's up to anyone watching? Post in chat for shoutouts, general discussion. We go down here. I'm scared to like hit B and then just drop because I'm not trying to die again, which is probably going to happen at this height. Should be fine to do B here. Here we go. Just going to hold it and let him go down the side into this weird little corner. But uh, that's where we're going, that little camp down there. And we're just going to put some stones together. It's been a while since I've been here on this crazy... uh. Crazy mountainous area. I really like this area, but it's hell of an area to, to navigate as well. You are quite good at this, these Karens. Is this Syria? Man, are you supposed to do this early on or something? This is a joke. I'm done. A monument to the gods. We were doing ones that were like three million stones tall. Here. I'll even, I'll even throw that over at the top. They never live in peace. They hardly bet an apple. Man, that was like beginner level. <laughs> did I ask it? This area is like high level, so why the hell do they have beginner level stuff? I'm so confused. We're supposed to do this area in the beginning of the game. It says power 280. That's why I didn't come up here. Maybe they just expected you to come up here naturally. I don't know. That is strange, though. All right, let's call our wolf. Oh, uh, rip. Now he'll show up eventually. It's probably not allowed to call him in inside of this place. The goal's three to six tomorrow. If I can be on any earlier, I'll try to be, but uh, there's no guarantees. Cause I have to uh, drive. It's only like a 20-minute drive, though. If I'm quick enough, I might be, on, be able to be on sooner. But I'm pretty sure where I'm going, they gotta leave it like two or something. So I figure that'll be my chance to head home. So if I'm lucky, maybe we'll do 245 tomorrow, but... Extra 15, do an extra mission with that, probably. There's no prep needed for the class, just gotta show up on time, but, uh... Definitely wanna grow before I show up to a three-hour class again, so... I did that to uh, try to prevent issues with my health. We one of these trippy ones. I'm gonna hallucination. Whoa, see the colors. <laughs> oh shit. This is like a mushroom attack on bad. Not condoning mushrooms, I'm not uh, speaking about them, but everyone in life's probably heard a story or two about mushrooms. They're actually legal in a few places nowadays, so I mean, technically, you know, when in Rome, yeah. <laughs> Time to get out to uh, some of those other states. <laughs> Imagine playing Valhalla, but it looks like this the whole damn time you're playing, like naturally in your own eyes. <laughs> it would actually be pretty cool. Hammer's so slow, it's kind of annoying. I also don't love the uh, giant shield. It looks cool, but it, I much prefer the uh, smaller shield. I'm trying to learn to attack. Because I'm out of arrows, which is not good. I gotta use the light attacks. How'd you miss, man? The hammer's badass when you actually get hits with it. 
But I have to use a completely different strategy than I'm used to because we uh, started out with axes, which means you, know, you just you go nuts with them. With the heavy and it kicks ass. The hammer, you gotta be a little bit more selective when you use the heavy. This ain't even Thor's hammer, by the way. Just a random hammer, I guess. Woo, that trip was totally spectacular. Thought I was in Jotunheim. All right. All right, we just got a few chests to grab. They should be easy enough. I feel like we're going to be done this area pretty quickly, and then we'll uh, start Hamptonshire, and I'm just going to grind, grind, grind on Hamptonshire as hard as we can today. I'm not going to do any more missions today. Tomorrow we'll, uh, we'll finish out collectibles in both of these regions and just officially go on to the mission track and achievement track through the rest of the game. can't believe I'm legit like seven missions from done the game. Who would have thought the day would come? I'm still kind of like, is there more? I know there's a lot more to go, but there's not a lot more to go. It's like... Legion, we probably have like one week of streams to do to be done with that game. That's how short it is. But we already played it quite a bit, so. Oh, I can loot the chest without opening it. There you go. I will not move it then, thank you. Bye-bye. We have for Flex this, uh... Flex scheduling this month, what was it? It was Little Nightmares and Rainbow Six Vegas 2. We ended up making Siege our flex and doing Vegas 2 on our once a month list because we uh, did the Siege with that Apocalypse event. One of my best Siege performance streams ever, crazily as it sounds. And then, uh... What's it called? I postponed Little Nightmares. I'm considering doing Little Nightmares next month during our uh, extra week. We're going to do console and PC week this time instead of just console week. Last time we did it, we did a... Uh, you know, donation to Semper Fi fund from all the, you know, revenue we made and stuff like that. It was a cool little week. We're going to do something similar. Maybe pick a different group. Maybe this time go for, uh, like, a PC charity or something. Gaming PC charity. <laughs> Help people get gaming composed. I wouldn't be surprised if that exists. Yeah, we, we could get behind that, you know. <laughs> Gotta help people out. So my last time, uh, I think we gave 15 bucks to Semper Fi Fund last time, so definitely was an awesome time and appreciate all the support. I went a little bit over the percentage we promised. I rounded up. I think I like doubled down or something, but we're a small channel. I was just like, whatever. Maybe we'll do something similar this time. But uh, it won't be only shooter games for the upcoming special week. I'll have more info on it you know, in June, but... Expect Star Citizen on a weekend night. Yes, that means we're going to be uh, having a few drinks and playing Star Citizen late at night. Which could go good or bad, considering I'll be flying a bunch of ships and stuff. And then, uh, whatever else happens. Definitely want to try and fit in Little Nightmares. I got to do a replay of the, the original game. Because they came out with Little Nightmares 2, but not for Series X, so I haven't bought it yet. I was also trying to get the Collector's Edition, because I had the first Collector Edition, but I'm, uh, idiot and kind of missed out on it so kind of where that goes I'm just gonna go over there <laughs> get over here this kind of reminds me of like some of those other games like there's World of Warcraft there's Elder Scrolls it's like Assassin's Creed's take on those kind of games it's an open world RPG those games can maybe have a little bit more flexibility in different paths you can choose and stuff like that. This is more of a linear path, but plenty of RPGs have the uh, you know a similar setup to this. So, it's including Skyrim is kind of similar. You know what I mean? It has obviously some main linear kind of setup for the missions. There can be different outcomes in certain stuff. Blah blah blah. Same shit, different story. So it's it's kind of cool. This is nothing like the original Assassin's Creeds, but. 
and I'll uh, show that to you guys when I play the original over the summer, hopefully. I want to see what time allows. Just telling me he can't jump up there. Enjoy the stream, definitely appreciate if you like and sub. <laughs> so the question is, where do we go now? We kind of end up in a different spot than I had originally planned. There's no fast travel point up here. There's these down here. There's this here this here. There's also... I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to go this way, break around. We can wrap around this entire area like this. Eventually coming back to here and moving alongside you know, this uh, route into the city in here. We'll have everything done and then we'll move on to Hamptonshire. So. It's going to take longer than doing the England because England's like flat and hilly for the most part so you're just traveling across land you're not really going up and down mountains where you gotta get off your damn you know, pet every 30 seconds Go! luckily with my half my body in this freezing cold water we're not affected in any <laughs> in any way The fuck? Well, we just ran into a bear. And I don't have arrows. Usually you can run around the area. You should usually run around these areas and collect stuff. This will be my first goal. I'm no longer scared of anything in this game. Origins, I went into everything under leveled, so I had to be afraid to get murdered in one hit while everyone took a massive amount of damage. And then Odyssey... I leveled up appropriately with the game. This game I leveled up like insanely well before I should have, so that's why it's uh, such a walk in the park. Bear blue waters. 
murder! crazy. Did not expect to walk up there and just get into a crazy fight with a bear, but that's <laughs> exactly what just happened. We'll go there, to there, to there, to here, and we'll have to make our way up and around. This wasn't planned for today, but I, I feel like it was a cool idea. I'm kind of happy we uh, changed it up. It's a nice change of pace. I needed the break from grinding England. So this is on our checklist as well. Wish we had access to Vinland, just so we can uh, knock that out too, but we'll work with it. to get in there. That's our goal right now. Show me. just decided it should go like a million miles in the sky over there. That was weird. I see there's a way underground here. I'll turn twice if I stay here. Here you go, check. Sometimes there's underwater pathways. There is a pirate ship over here, which kind of makes me wonder if, uh... Something over here, no. Yep. Called it. Apparently there's two of them in here. Even better than one. Boom. I think that gives us okay to uh, head north. Wish there was a fast travel point up there. There might be just one really far up. Sure, before we freeze it. It'll take us out in the water, so it's good. Achievement Seahorse, 10 gamer score. Swim a total of 3 kilometers with a horse. Well, that was random. I saw that achievement earlier when I was checking out the achievement list, and I was like, that sounds like a terrible achieve. I'll just have to go down the rivers <laughs> and on the on the horseback, but AKA the wolfback. But uh, I don't think we need to.
nice little journey to go. Thanks to anyone watching. Post in chat for shout out, general discussion. Might not even have to get spotted for this. Yeah, we're probably gonna have to get spotted for this. face no one I'm just gonna run away What's my lead? It's here for a few things and I can get them as fast as possible without fighting all you we'll probably be back here for some like, kind of like mission later on or something there are two missions here hey. so I wouldn't be surprised Out here, help, help. Peace out, y'all. Enjoy your freedom, but make sure you kill them for me. <laughs> There's a trade. They gave me freedom to get up here as quick as possible and get out of here. And I give them freedom from that uh, cage back there. I think that's a reasonable trade. Up we go. We'll see you later, people. So we literally just gotta work our way in those directions. Imagine how horrifying this would be. One Ava right there. Yes. Shoo! And that, that was so high, I was gonna buy. I would get away from that edge, man. I would not want to be anywhere near it. We're so high up right now, yo, it's crazy. Yeah. Oh, we're off. I 
Now this is what I call fucking crazy exploring you. I would not want to do this in real life. I feel safe right here compared to where we were. That straight down cliff edge seems like a, a death wish. I'm just going to check every once in a while because we got to see if anything pops up. There might be absolutely nothing back here. Other than like something all the way at the end of it. It might just be open. Usually people probably just grab a boat <laughs> and come down the river or the inlet to uh, this region. I like to just come in by horseback by climbing insanely tall mountains and then going down the other side. I don't see a damn thing in this entire area. Fucking sheer cliff side, yeah. All the way up there. Apparently, we found like what looks like a road. thing I mean I'm not seeing anything there in this entire stretch but we still got to go back up in there to see what's up there so I'm starting to wonder if there's nothing up here if there's nothing up here at least we came and explored to make sure but treacherous as fuck back here. I wish we could just send in the bird to, uh, you know, scan the area, but unfortunately I don't think it works. <laughs> Sorry if you hear my chair complaining in the background. It's like, I need to go out in the trash. <laughs> I'm no longer good. I'm just like, I know, I know. Come on, you can get up there. You can get up there. Don't bullshit me now. Go. Yep, there is something back here. A fucking shit ton of bears, too. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go see what this is. There's no way they have this back here and there's nothing in it. This is it, seriously. There's nothing, there's nothing here. Man. There's literally nothing here, yeah. begin our journey out of here I guess. That sucks. I'm gonna go over this side just to make sure there's nothing over here but just a ton of bears, that's all I see. So I wanna go up there real quick. If we can get the high ground maybe just go across the top on the way uh back to where we're trying to go. Come on. It's 
fighting me trying to get up here, but. Phew. There's something further east? Or is this just snow land? There's nothing else out here. We officially hit the limits, so we're going to work our way back to uh, my markers, I guess, at this point. We've already ridden out here. Might as well take the, uh, the journey back. Possibly just nothing out this way. But I wanted to make sure. I'm glad we came because we got to see that bear spot and stuff, but... Unfortunately, I think we have to go down to the water level. Yo! Taking a cruise. Ooh. If you check, there's yeah, there's, there's gonna be nothing. We might as well set a marker for uh, here. We're gonna go here to here to this area there's one wealth left which is I believe this one right here then we have two mysteries one's right here so we have two artifacts which are one and two where's the other mystery and the other mystery is right here so that's pretty much everything covered right there so that's all there is left and then we'll be uh, going back to England for the rest of the stream Start slamming out Hamptonshire and teaching a lesson. Maybe I'll start with the raids because those are going to carry some of the biggest weight and the wealth that we can get. Each of the, the raids, I think, have like five wealth in one region. So it'll make for easy uh, banging out the list. We'll figure it out when we go back. Interesting replaying like the original Assassin's Creed. I should look up how long it is. I guarantee it's like 20 hours compared to this. Which, uh, we could probably get done within like two weeks of playing. If that's the case, I'm definitely doing it. I think Fable 1 is pretty long with the DLC or something like that. But, or maybe that's Fable 2 and 3. But I was going to play those with Electrovolts. I thought that'd be a cool idea. I think Electrovolts uh, would be right down her alley. Simple game, easy to control. Fun to play. What the fuck was that? I'm gonna watch that on stream because that was weird as fuck. Give me a sec. I'm watching it back. The stream's delayed like 15 seconds. I really just want to see what just happened there. We literally just ducked under water. <laughs> that was so random. Yep, I just watched it. What the hell? <laughs> All right, let's begin our uh, steep, clo you know, st steep uh, slope climb. I'll try and get some good pictures up here in the mountains, but 
this is obviously a horrible idea. I'm just gonna fast travel up to here. It's gonna be much more pain in the ass to climb that than it is gonna be to climb over from being up high all to another spot up high. See, we gotta go down, but I'd rather do a 400 down than 200 up. It's right over there. We could probably just jump down over here and call in. Alright, let's go. I feel like today's stream was a little bit quieter than our typical ACV stream, but yeah, it happens. Should have been Star Citizen week, but what we decided is to postpone all the Star Citizen streams till Invictus, because Invictus is like a week-long event. And again, anyone who has a PC can, can handle it, can play for free, so cough, cough, J Smoke, I highly recommend you look into it. If you can play for free, man, I mean, why not, you know what I mean? You can at least join and check it out. You carry no blade. Only shields. I am impervious to all but the iron of a true drinker. Ragnar Lothbrok knew this, and bade me carry only boards, as a challenge. Now he is gone, and I remain. I wish to die, but I cannot, for he made me too strong. Now I spend my time longing for his company. You must have a weak point. None that I'm aware of. I was always the center of Ragnar's shield wall. He trusted me with the defenses of his great army. My flesh, scarred and trained by Ragnar, is now like an iron weave. It pains me. How can I join him if none can kill me in battle? I see no way in which this can occur. Unless you prove me wrong, fair challenger. Let me do the honor of breaking Ragnar's shield wall. I hope you will. Let me now prepare the shield wall. Lord Ragnar, will this be the day? Stand fast, warrior. And if Loki rules the day, you may have a chance. I am a is impenetrable. This is my skill. This is my curse. I am Orwig never. I wish to die. I am a is impenetrable. So if you wish to die, then my skill. This is my curse. I am Orwig never. I wish to die. nearby and there's any arrows nearby so we gotta fight them tougher enemies I fought in this game so because of the damn shields
I never thought I would feel this. Vulnerable. Death lurking near. Victory is yours. Victory is mine. Stand fast and tall, he who cannot die. The gates open for you. <laughs> it's an odd way to die, but... He heard the words and just magically left this world. And the answer chat was Star Citizens free J Smoke at the end of the month. For a whole week. While they're doing the event that I was talking about, so if you want to try installing it and running it, then it's your time. Oh, we got a new quest. Back in England, I think. Just gonna head south, hit those two, then go from there. We're almost done this uh, region in the game, then we'll go back for the final region in England, and then the, all that would be left is uh, Vinland. So between this and next week, I'm pretty hopeful that we'll get the game full 1K'd. Including a full completion of all main missions, all side missions, and all collectibles. Well, we gotta keep grinding. We still have about uh, an hour and a half today. We're going for five on the clock, which is crazy as hell, but we're doing it. I uh, drank some more energy drinks, so I'm pumped up and ready to go. That was easy. If you uh, check the Discord, J Smoke in the PC Gamers section and scroll up, you'll see the post by night with a lot of details on it when it's free to play and stuff on PC. So definitely, uh, we're gonna be streaming it like two or three times that week at least. So that's the one week ACV is gonna get uh, only played like two days or something when we have uh, the Star Citizen game event. It's only a one week real life event. Where uh, we're going to be able to fly ships I don't own that cost real money in real life. Like $100 ships and stuff of real money. they would have to pay in the game to get them and stuff. So I 100% got to uh, check it out. Plus some of the biggest ships in the game are going to make their appearance. That should be interesting as well. And Knight also got a tank now in that game that uh, blows up ships in one shot. So we're going to mess around with those as well. So it should be a good time. I can let you fly my ship, J-Smoke, if you join. I think it's free fly period, so anyone who plays for free can fly in the game for free. So. Go for that. Then we'll break off down this way, tackle that. We'll have to go back through all these cities and do like the Orlog and the drinking games and shit that we don't do... Uh, Yeah, right, we'll go this way. There's some achievements, so we're gonna have to go back through some areas again, but I'll uh, make sure I have to get like checklists so we know we're doing. That's a weird spot. Impressive. 
It's this asshole. Enough to join? <laughs> no, not today. But who can say where fate will fling us? Indeed. Let us hope we both land on the same side. We're definitely going to be done this area today and we got at least uh, like an hour or something in Hamptonshire as well. The final region. Tomorrow we'll finish out Hamptonshire. I think uh, Monday we'll get to Vinland. By Tuesday we'll be done with the game. And Wednesday, Thursday next week are probably going to go to achievement hunting. Which will include doing the, uh, yeah, the treasures. It's going to include doing uh, you know, miscellaneous achievements like sliding for 150 meters and random shit like that. So open up true achievements or one of those sites and kind of just go to town right down the list maybe record some achievement hunting videos for people that's one of our uh, our channel thrives on apparently uh, drag racing videos tour videos and achievement videos for anyone who doesn't know you go to our uh, top playlists or you sort our videos by views our live streams are nowhere in there it's all our other content so this Friday I'm releasing the Kasaka tour, as in the uh, submarine maxed out from GTA. Then I'm also going to, uh... Oh god. I wish probably go back in, because for some reason the damn wooden fence won't break. But, uh... You know, Saturday I think we're releasing a Hitman 3 video. We have to go out that way. What the fuck? It won't open. Wow. Come on, ACV. I'm sitting that thing the whole time. You're gonna break now. <laughs> so one, two, three. That'll cover the final wealth and two artifacts, and then we'll have the final mystery. And then I'll complete the region. We're that close. It's crazy. I mean, I guess we could stop and do the drinking game if we want to. At least we'll have it off our checklist, so we don't have to worry about it next time. Should be an easy one, I hope. Shall we lock horns? Down it faster than me, and you are the victor. Ha! We drink. Yep. We were doing one where there was like seven or eight of these horns, and you were like. By like horn number two, you were like spinning around. This is me on Friday before our night stream. Like before I get on DVD this Friday. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's just whiskey, just whiskey in there. My horn full of whiskey. Oh god. You would have been done on the first horn for the night. Second horn, yeah, you're gonna puke. The third horn, yeah, you're probably gonna black out. Fourth horn, you're gonna get alcohol poisoning. Of course, right at that second it asked for me to hit the uh, button, I lift my left hand off my controller and adjust my headset. Hopefully you guys didn't hear me because I kind of rushed to uh, move my hand back from the headset down the controller, but I don't think I smacked the mic. Hopefully I didn't because it would have been annoyingly loud. Like, yeah, I'm the victor, yeah. I'm a better alcoholic than you, man. <laughs> Pretty much how it is in this game. <laughs> I mean, hey, it's a different time period. God knows what the average uh, lifespan was back in these times. There was a pretty sure way back in the day, you know, you'd be happy to be like 35. That would be like the average life of a person. It is a paper. It is up on the tree. You shall go get it. And hope that the game cooperates in thine button functionality so it doesn't screw me up. Where the hell did it go? Fuck. I didn't see where it went. Go, go, go. If we're quick enough, we can still get it.
Yeah, we're not getting in time. It's gonna go away. No, oh, it waited. That was pure luck, because that should have definitely left. I swear, this area says high level, but it's these are easier than some of the stuff I've been doing lately in the other regions back in England. And it's higher level than those regions, which doesn't make much sense. Get that key. So we're probably going to need it to get the uh, chest. Or to get into the chest is a better way to put it. is gone. Where's the cellar? I'm gonna guess it's down there. Which means we need an arrow, which of course I don't see a definite arrow anywhere to be found. We can probably fill, kill a few guards to get some uh, points. store around here we're going to the store real quick I'm tired of being out of shit whoever this owns the store is about to make a lot of money <sighs> we need a bunch of arrows a lot of arrows welcome welcome come see what I have oh this is a nice one I heard this bow is really good. Such a wise choice, made with the finest ingredients. Wonderful! No refunds. Yes, you've made the right choice. You should always have some of these. You couldn't have made a better choice. Never been used. Are you sure there is... I'm... We have one point to go to Raven. Alright, so now let's go back. This will be it for the Norway portion of the map, though. All we'll have left is one region, England, and then Vinland, which... Isn't Vinland like North America? Or am I throwing that off horribly? Or is it Greenland? I don't know why I'm brain farting. It's been too long. I took a, a class that actually went over this stuff back in college. Finland, yeah, it's North America. So he was here before Columbus, just, you know, just everyone's away. So that whole thing is FUBAR, sir. Propaganda. Leif Erikson, should be Leif Erikson Day, man. I've been able to catch him before, before the end, but it's not often. You have to be really, really fast. Alright, Eivor, go over those. If we do one more little sprint like that, we might catch you.
Got it. Two things left. this and we have one more uh, mysterious mission some sort. so here's the house we had to get in the cellar which I believe is down here Avor go down I'm pressing B there you go buddy this game sometime just like every Assassin's Creed they all have their flaw and like functionality when it comes to climbing up and down hence why there's the memes of them being like climb up and then they jump off the wall and you know it shows like the controller going through the TV and stuff. So, yep, that's Assassin's Creed. <laughs> Ability upgrade. Yay. 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 Smash your shit. Yay. The guy's gonna be pissed to find that I'll smash it in one day when he goes down there. <laughs> that was very nice of me. Here, can you get me there by following the road or do I gotta do it? I think he'll do it himself. fuck he's going, it's this way. Final thing in this entire region. We're only going to get like an hour in Hamptonshire at this point, but an hour in Hamptonshire is probably half of it completed. Especially if we do the raids up front, because uh, that's going to be most of the wealth. At least half or more of the wealth done. So I think each area has like four or five wealth all just cluttered throughout. What is all this? Who bangs the drums of war? Look at you! A battle-hardened vikinger! <laughs> Just what we need! Oh, and what do you need this battle-hardened warrior for? One day, we will be the greatest warriors beneath our banner! Skulls will write songs off the wolf pack! But we must first practice our raiding! <laughs> Going on a raid! Then we shall raid! Three wolves and I will be forced to your lead. Wolf pack! Onwards! Wolf pack! They ran. Four warriors, like four limbs of one clawing body. Each limb built to kill. Destroy. Um, where are we going the raid? It's probably not a good idea to take these kids raiding, but yeah, whatever. And Lou, well, this is like two in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Just find these fucking kids outside. They arrived at the village. Torches, axes, and blades at the ready. Ready for the slaughter. To war! Uh... Kill him! The prey has no time to run. No time to even blink. As his trachea is ripped out through his neck. We won the raid. Bam! An arrow flies right into the body of an enemy. Lou, where are you going? Ah, a successful raid. Yes. With your help, we slaughtered the Raven Clan. Oh god, the Raven Clan. The Raven Clan, you say? Yes. Just like Shot the Yarl's stories. One day, I'll be just like him. Oh god. Catless young raiders. I'll see you wolves on another battlefield one day. 
burn it down before they can practice more. <laughs> Apparently they were evil kids. Oh well, they're kids, I mean. You can only hope that, uh, you know, something sways them someday, but they're probably going to see me on the battlefield and get killed, but we'll give them the time to train and spend their whole life preparing to die. So that's the sadder part of the story. <laughs> they ain't going to beat Eivor, that's for sure. We're officially done with uh, this region in the game. So it's time to go back to England. Actually, we have to go back there for two missions later on, but not yet. There's two missions there we gotta do. Two missions in Hamptonshire, three in Vinland, and we still gotta do the... Clean up the areas of uh, Vinland and Hamptonshire, plus obviously do the achievements, so... And the treasures. That's pretty much all there is to the game left for a 100% run, I'm pretty sure. Figured uh, we should get started down here. See what I'm saying? There's like one, two, three, four, five of all those little wealth things you see are right here. If we do the other raid, that's another one, two, three. There's like five per raid. So we might as well just jump into a raid. Today we do both raids and then we hop into one of the uh, viewpoints and we begin, you know, going counterclockwise or clockwise around the map and that's pretty much how it's going to go tomorrow we'll finish it out do the missions here if we can or whatever the missions the game throws me into and see what happens <laughs> now we're in 12 minutes left let's get out of here 630 sharp 100 percent we'll cut it too late today's a dumbbell bike day i think we're having some kind of i don't even know what the hell we're having for dinner at this point And, uh, yeah, gotta do some class, and I haven't read Order of the Phoenix in a while. I'm about halfway done the book, so I'm hoping to get a chapter in later. But we're gonna replay LEGO Harry one, uh, years 1 through 4 anyway, I think, for a full 1K gamer score, if I'm not mistaken, was our thought on that, so. I do not want to read. Keep going. We'll only raid the right place. When we are there, we'll kill everybody. All right, so we're gonna get one, two, three, then we're gonna get four, five, six. From there, we find a fast travel point to raid here. We grab everything here, and then from there, we can figure out what we wanna do. It's probably, uh, yeah. obviously we have to work our way around. I already did Winchester, so we're pretty much working our way around here. We did like uh, some most regions within uh, one afternoon, so. We had a decent chunk done now. Especially when they have so many wealth you know, sprinkled in one area, we'll probably have, uh, like I said, half the wealth done. Two raids. Why is it not letting me raid, the fuck? Can't raise the sail yet. If they see me, this will get messy. There we go. Probably because we were moving so fast. Why would they stop here? I guess we decide we want to take a swim while we raid. Usually they ram in the shore. <laughs> Alright, we're here. Of course, at night time. I'm going to sprint around and just get the stuff done. We fought so many people in this game, I'm not too worried about fighting everyone. Get it away from me. Time to die. Give me a hand. I found some lonely treasure, Eivor. Hey, come here. Mm. Uh, 
rocks at me, you Are you serious, bud? Are you serious, bud? Now, can I please go in the door? No, I don't want to carry this fucking dude. Why are they only attacking me? That's the other thing with video games that doesn't make sense. You'll play like shooter games like COD or something, and for some reason there's like 30 soldiers on your team, and then the only, everybody just attacks you. It's like, the fuck, dude. There's plenty of other people to fight. Let me open the door. I fought like 3 million people in this game at this point. Trust me, I, I can do without a few extra fights. <laughs> Can't do this alone. Oh my fucking god, dude. Are you really gonna keep spawning stuff, people at my asshole game? It's getting excessively annoying, though. Fuck off, skirmisher, dude. Now, can I please open the mother flarping door? Alright, dude, get the fuck out of the way. Holy shit, game. Is this game trying to screw me? Look at him, he's blocking the fucking door now. Assassin's Creed. Really? Really? Look, the motherfucker's just standing in the door. Yeah, that really helps me get the job done. Damned. Need to get on the other side. Man. Had a pretty nice afternoon. Gotta leave it up to ACV to... Look, nope. You get screwed over, man, by the AI, dude. <laughs> get the fuck out of the door! Won't even let me access the door now because. There we go. Fucking asshole. So I want to do that guy blocking the door. Unfortunately, I can't because he's on my side. But he would have deserved. Are right, you like stuck back there, dude? Jackass who couldn't get through, let me through the door. Man, he's not gonna help me. He's gonna block me and then not help me. I got some normal chest to grab too. is it? Ah, it's upstairs. Come on, Eivor. Why, why can't you climb up? Thank you. Game functionality. Please stop breaking. It's like A is to go up and it'll like, you hit A, it'll just like hesitate and think twice about his life. Then it'll jump off. And you're like, the hell are you doing? Dude, Eivor, do you need help climbing up that wall? Do you really? Please go up the wall. <laughs> fuck the fuck. Bludgeon he deserves. a hand over here. Don't go now. 
a worthless team. And now can you guys come with me? Come, help me with this. Don't shoot, let him burn. All right, let's go. Hey, come here. We're almost done this raid. So percent of the uh, wealth just from one region in the re this entire uh, area. <sighs> Do want to go down there and get that real quick. Then I'll decide if I want to hop into the next raid or if we should just start tackling the map from up here. Start circling around, getting everything done today. So we still have an hour to go, technically. So plenty of time to get shit done. Block it from the other side. So we completed that. Our options are one, like I said, consider going to this raid, but I don't see any good points to do the raid from, so we might as well just start tackling the land comes down to which way do we want to go? Do we want to go clockwise or counterclockwise? Alright, we're out. Let's begin our journey of uh, the final region in England that I have to do in the game. I highly doubt we'll get it done within an hour, but I guarantee tomorrow we'll uh, finish out Hamptonshire, probably completely. There's, like I said, only two missions here. And there's only two missions in the other area, so we might be able to even get done that northern Norway region completely. And early next week, I expect to be in Vinland. By end of next week, I expect to be at 1K. The week after that, I expect to get in the DLC, but I have no idea what to expect from the DLC. It actually looked pretty massive. Uh, looked like there was a small map, and it had the same deal. You gotta, like, do missions for each of the regions. And kind of build a big army. Make an alliance uh, thing again. Which is kind of stupid if they just mimicked what they did in the base game. They should have did something different. But I'm hoping it's not like 50 hour DLC. But you never know with Assassin's Creed these days. It might be like a 20 hour DLC. But that I won't be surprised. Play it again, Saxon. Hey, you there, Dave. Come join your fellows. Music is... Here's a merry gathering. A Saxon playing for Norseman. What joy a man gives is given back. 
threefold. So my love used to say, dear Chiro. I sing now for her. Used to. Used. But now is no time for sadness. Join our revels. I was about to open a cask for my new friends. Come one, come all. Nothing heals the heart of woe like a mug of ale. You look like the sort who laps at their brew like a kitten. Wrong. Thor himself pales when he sees me take up my drinking horn. Ha! Come and prove it then. Saxon, give us a song. The Lord made me, and the Lord made thee, and the Lord made hops and barley. So if you would close to heaven be, have another ale or three. Drink some mead and drink some rum, for ye know not when the Lord will come. So drink thy ale and drink it fast, who knows if it may be your last! Show me how the Raven Clan drink. You'll be under the table before I have even warmed up. Oh, -ho! we'll see about this. The Lord made me, and the Lord made thee, and the Lord made hops and barley. So if you would close to heaven, be have another rail or free. <laughs> The fuck? This is poison ale. Oh, feels like Jormungandr is turning in my stomach. Why, Odin, this new ale is strong. He poisoned us. I promised my love as she lay dying, a Danish arrow in her breast. A hundred lives for hers. But there is one who has not been laid low. Let me see to that. You will die as my hero did! It won't be me that dies today. Ah, oh, God, my head. I'll grant you the long piece of the grave! those three next. Back in England's nice, as much as I really enjoy the Norway part of the map, it's fucking ridiculous to climb around it. You guys saw it when we were there. It's a beautiful landscape, but when you're trying to climb those mountains, it takes like a half hour because you gotta climb like extremely tall mountains just to go a short distance, and then you gotta get off, and then you gotta rock climb, and it's just like, oh god. Glad to be done, fully done with Norway, other than the uh, final two missions in the game there. Yeah, from what I count, I think seven missions ago in just uh, two regions, this and Vinland, but we don't get Vinland till the end of the game. So We also have to kill the Order and the, the, the other random achievements, but uh, that should come. Some of them definitely will pop within the next uh, few days. Well, today, tomorrow, then we'll be back next Monday through Thursday on this. So we'll see how the cookie crumbles. Not sure what this is right here. I guess a mask maybe. Nope, it's one of those. <laughs> Why? This game, just like every Assassin's Creed I play has to do that. He'll be uh, holding down A, which is to climb up, and he'll literally jump down. I don't even know where the fuck it went, so I'm going to jump down and give up, because I... It threw me off the second it dropped off. It'll respawn in a moment. That's so stupid, though. 
I remember the days of trying to go through windows in the older Assassin's Creed, and you'd go back and forth 35 times trying to get through a window just to get spotted on like the last mission in the game. And it would just turn into a torture fest from what should have been fun. You're like, ah. Man, are you serious, little snake? We got it early. We didn't have to finish. That was how it should have went the first time. Your time is come. I'll keep the rat busy. here underground. One thing I hate about the hammer, it's fucking slow sometimes. A little bit too slow, especially for faster enemies. Let's let him burn. Get round the side. Yeah, you can go for the bell, but shut the bell down already, you're just still trying to get over there. Pretty sure this is the key for down here. Boom. Check the actual stream clock number. Where are we at? We're at four hours and 37 minutes. So we, on a typical day, we would have ended seven minutes ago when we go for four and a half, but should be at five and a half today. It's crazy as sounds. So let's keep trucking. Definitely starting to feel fried a little bit, but uh, I don't want to give up yet. We're making so much progress. I remember I spent, I think I used to do three, four streams in a row sometimes when we were finishing up Origins and Odyssey. We get to that final stretch and it would feel like it was never going to end and I would uh, start playing the game a shit ton. side must be barred.
Ah, there's the vipers! <laughs> That's good. That's the last thing we need in this uh, area. Apparently the armory is down here. That was weird, the whole thing moved. And look at the old statues. That'd be cool as hell. If you like own one of those. <laughs> Probably invaluable though, so good luck getting one. <laughs> Probably buy fake ones. Modern ones, a better way to put it. Apparently we have to go up there and grab that chest real quick. From there, I think I'll just fast travel to here, and then we can continue on down to here. So let's do that. We're just going to keep grinding until time's up. Once we get to like 6.25, I'll uh, start focusing on getting ready to get off. But we still have uh, 40 minutes till that, so 45 till we're off. So. On tomorrow's around three to six so instead of five hour you know our usual four hour and a four hour plus break afternoon we're doing a five and a break today and then we'll do three without a break tomorrow so that's what i'm saying we should be able to get this region done tomorrow if not get through the story a little bit further but uh that'll be it for this week because we got cod friday our night streams and then more cod on saturday Actually, I forgot. Next Thursday, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to uh, swap this. This might get mixed up a little bit next week. We'll see how I uh, work it out. But I also might have an extra stream or two next week if I want to. So. So we just gotta escape and then fast travel. travel now go there break south then we'll break uh, west from where we're going and kind of just maneuver in random zigzags across the map there's a lot of mysteries a lot of wealth a lot of stuff here
All right, here we go. I found nobody uh, noticed me walking. They'll probably hear that, that's for sure. Apparently my dinner plans are changing. Like Travolta should let me know. So I guess we're maybe getting delivery. I know I'm getting delivery on Saturday. I had a drive through today. I like to keep it to two takeouts a week plus one drive through <laughs> At most. So I guess that's right on par, I guess. Question is, how the fuck... Ah. I'm blind. That's what you do down here. The problem is, we gotta find the... Other way in now. Talk to Electro Volts after this because uh, I'm going to need at least an hour to exercise and all that stuff anyway after the stream. So, order the food then. Bamboo. Distressed. So would you be if your every crop of turnips was demolished by a horde of mangy horrors? I assume you mean the rabbits in that field. Aye, them. Then I'd put rats with ears stuck on. I'd slay them if I could, but they're too damn fast. When I catch you, I'll impale you, maim you, send you to bunny hell. Thank <sighs> you. 
<laughs> just blow them the fuck up. Like the hairballs of Satan that they are. Lopsy, Lord Snuffles, what have they done to you? Just take it. I warned you what would happen if you let them in my turnip patch again. Oh, my babies. They're not to blame. How could you? You've gone too far this time, wife. And she killed his rabbits. A little more damage her crops with my explosion, so. Second floor. Down to 35 left. Oh, man. It's going to be nice to uh, go exercise because I've been sitting so long today. I sat all morning working on the uh, the website transfer. Now I sat all afternoon streaming. I mean, I'm going to sit on the bike, I guess, but in a way, <laughs> at least I'll be moving. See what's going on over here. What happened here? And what befell the driver? Tournament invitation. Bear fighting tournament. Gratitude is touching. Gratitude? That was my prize fighting bear you killed. How am I supposed to make my living now? It is thanks to me that you are living at all. Oh, thank you, your majesty. Please accept my eternal loyalty for condemning me to abject poverty. I should teach you some manners. You can take your manners and shove them at all in can't see. Let's do this, you filthy Dane. Man. Stilling that bitter tongue was a service to all.
That's what I think of him. It seems we're just changing our plans. I'm getting delivery tonight now. Then tomorrow night, I'm gonna have uh, leaks and something else. If you guys ever heard of leaks, maybe something like ground beef or something. Then uh, I don't know what I'm doing Friday. Yet. I was hoping to get my hands on some soft shell crabs, but the damn food store is always sold out. So I'm either gonna pick a different type of seafood to cook up, or uh, maybe grab a steak out of the fridge. I don't know. I mean the freezer. Letter with red finger prints all over it. Feel stronger already. Where you go? Eivor, seriously? You're fucking just gonna fall when I tell you to jump straight over? What the fuck's this shit? Eivor, seriously, this is why you're not an assassin. You get your shit together, bro. Failed me utterly. I don't know where the fuck I'm going now because he had to fall. All I know is we entered over there. We were trying to go somewhere like that. We might as well just start climbing back up again. I never fell down one of these pitch black uh, yeah, ravines or whatever you want to call it. So I never experienced what's down there. But if you don't know, now you know. It's a pretty good statement for what's down there. Alright, Eivor, can you please go over there? It's not... It's right there to the ledge, bro. Oh my god. There goes Eivor letting, letting go again. For no fucking reason at all. Legitimately no good reason. I'm in mechanics, man.
The mantle of Arthur of Cordwell. Fuck man, did I just go back the wrong way? We're back in this room. How, how do we end up back here? That's nice. Eivor, where are you going? Dude! Holy fucking shit, dude. This is just getting annoying now. I'm telling you to go to the fucking tree. Stop jumping off the fucking cliff. For fuck's sake. Need to be careful here. <laughs> You know, he obviously can't make it up there. So get the fuck out of here, game. <laughs> Serious. Avor would absolutely make it up there. Figured it out. Pass traveling the hell out of there so we can start grabbing chests around the outskirts of the city. Fall. 
So we're getting down to uh, just over 20 minutes left, and that'll include me going through the outro. So we'll say 20 minutes. It's two minutes definitely at least, or more to do the outro. So. Through the window. I'm telling you, this game has so many broken functionalities. The window's right there, Eivor. Please go through the fucking window. It is blatantly right here. Please go through that. Oh my god, is this game fucking kidding me right now, dude? Eivor can't go through there. Fuck out of here, developers. What are you smoking when you do this shit? I swear. We can't even get a fucking angle to shoot in there, so this is just WTF moment, if anything. Yeah, guys, I don't know what the fuck to tell you. The game's starting to piss me off today. I'm starting to regret doing a five-hour session, because apparently Eivor doesn't know how to go through a fucking window. Legitimately, he won't go through a friggin' window. What's up with that, man? What is up with that? Let's go through the effing window, bro. It's the only way in. So just go through it. <laughs> ah! Huh? Google this because I can't be the only fucking person who's having trouble going through a little wind like a window that can fit like a, my entire body easily. It's actually exceptionally annoying right now. Nothing online to help. Apparently, we're just going to be fucked on this chest, I guess, at this point. Because apparently, Eivor can't go through a giant opening window. Will make him happy if I break these little windows? This game effing up because of that? It's just not letting me choose to go through the window. What the fuck, yo? It's blatantly big enough for my body, but it just oversees it and just goes right above it, no matter what I do. Eivor. Thank you. Jeez Louise, man. I really enjoy this game, and I'm a huge fan of Assassin's Creed series, but can these people please get it the fuck together when it comes to in-game functionality? When I'm telling them to climb up, please stop jumping off walls. When I'm trying to go through a window, please stop doing everything but go through the window. This window's issue has been an issue since I played, like, AC2. I used to want to, like, smash my TV sometimes trying to get through windows in some of those missions. You'd, like, hover around the window for, like, a half hour to get in. It's like, come on, man. Let's go in the fucking window. Let's go in, Eivor. Go in. Thank God, there's no windows over here. Just fucking, yeah, nice swim in the water. Ah.
other than the weird camera view. We got less than 20 minutes left. In about 15, I'm gonna start uh, getting ready to power down. So we're in. deal with this shit. Get out of here, wolf. Get out of here. fucking window bro can you please stop missing what i want to do developers what are you doing you put the window up here and then you make me miss it half the time we play the game thank you jeez louise i didn't even have to go through the window but still it's like it's supposed to be a functionality that system that should just work why am i avoiding where i need to go like uh, this game is really starting to piss me off. It went pretty smooth for like the first four hours. Now in the last like hour of our five hour day, it's just like fuck you pretty much to me right now. It's like, no, you're not going to go where you want to go anymore. <laughs> We're going to make sure that your day gets squandered by the remainder of torturous bullshit. I do, uh, 100% this game's getting more bugged and more annoying as you get further in. That's the only thing I'm noticing. Still enjoying it to most of the extent, but I'm noticing a lot more bullshit as we're getting further in. It's kind of annoying. In my view, they gotta get their shice together. Patch this shit up and don't release another one until you work out these climbing mechanics and going through windows and shit. Change the buttons. Yeah, it's stuff like that. Have a button that tells the character to go through a window. You like press RB while climbing to enter window and everyone will like applaud and we'll have a major fucking like stadium cheering and shit. It'll be a whole new world of AC. Alright, get your head out of the fucking wolf's ass, Eivor. What is up with that? That's another issue I've been noticing. The game, instead of letting me get on the wolf's back, just shoves Eivor's head up the wolf's asshole. Like, legitimately. 
His head was up in there. I mean, what the fuck's going on? In <laughs> I watched you on your approach. How must it feel not to carry the weight of years? I am not a child. Yet I see in you a child's blissful ignorance of the world's darkest truths. A fool. You gathered all this from a glance? In this way, I am wise. Perhaps you will learn better through flighting. I will challenge you. I guess we'll, uh... We'll flight him. I accept. And I will place a wager on it. Here's my bet. You may begin. You are savage, uncouth, and care little for life. Like the rest of your kind, you breed misery and strife. Both your hands bear the blood of one thousand dead men. Well, perhaps they should have known not to challenge me then. A crude response. I am dismayed. It's a shame you're so calloused by warfare and pain. That you'll joke about death and treat life with disdain. Is it worth it? The killing, the torture, the slaves. It is not mine to judge, only fill up the graves. <sighs> that was fine. Yes, your avarice means that you'll just never see that this war will not grant immortality. You have one life to live, so why throw it away? To ensure that I'll sit in Valhalla one day. Enough. I've heard more than my fill of your cruelty. Take your winnings. May spending them bring you fleeting joy. I promise it will. Achievement. Slam Master, 30 gamer score. Complete all the flightings. Bamboosh. Okay, we have uh we have under ten minutes now left. Whatever we don't get done today we'll finish tomorrow. We uh for Hampton Shire we're about a third through. We'll hundred percent get it done tomorrow. Probably over the course of uh the first half of the stream. And then we'll uh hop into the missions and next week we'll f yeah, go from there. But this is the final region I have available to complete till we get to Vinland. And then we just got uh, four missions to do, and then three missions slash completing anything that's available in Vinland, and that'll sum it up. Do it for Keep grinding, because if I can get a few more things done before we go, the better. But I'm definitely uh, ready for a break. What? Do you often think of your father? Yes. Do you believe him a coward? He is a coward, as everyone says. And now he lives with hell. Her servant slow and lazy. Her curtains die a luck pulled across his bed. You should win back the honor he lost. I will. I know you will. Gotta just figure out what side's gonna sit better on here. It sucks. There's no way this is gonna hold. But I'll try.
fucking motherfuck shit. <laughs> Come on, man. <sighs> I'd rather give up on this and go do something else with the remainder of our time than get frustrated doing stone stacking. Can't believe we fucking did that. We're down to like four minutes left, so. We're already at the story. Let's see the story and then I'm gonna get off. Like, there's no. I, I really don't wanna go past 6 30. I'm already uh, been on for like five hours plus a break, but. You pace about like a dog afraid of a beating. What troubles you? Oh, stranger. Here's a tale. I love Evelyn, a hunter's daughter. But the hunter's a fearsome fellow. Set me a task, he did. There's an arrow stuck in that tree above that the hunter once fired there. Before any man can have Etherland, they need to climb up and get it. Many suitors have tried. All failed. Looks like child's play to me. Maybe I can help. Oh, you do mean to help me. God bless you. Where does he want us to go? here me to go. I have the arrow. Proof of your boundless courage. Oh, thank you, stranger. I'll name our firstborn in your honor. Swear I will. Uh, what is your name? Eivor. Eivor, eh? Well, maybe just something that rhymes with it, then. Would that do? I found the other suitors. A lynx had made its lair up there. A hunter like Etherlin's father would have known that. Oh, uh, surely an innocent mistake. But I must bring him the arrow. He'll be so pleased someone's got it at last. I am sure her father will be thrilled. That would be the uh, final world event we're completing today. We're gonna start, uh, we're gonna go up here again and make a save at the top of this rock. But uh, for anyone interested, yeah, that was it for our time for today. We've been grinding for uh, about five hours now. 
We did five and a half hour stream today. Tomorrow we're gonna be doing three hours of Valhalla from uh probably roughly three to five, just so everyone's aware. If anyone's interested, and then no more Valhalla to next week, and it'll be uh, Monday through Wednesday, and then we're gonna work it out either Friday or Saturday. Or we might, you know, break it into separate streams. I'm not sure what we'll do yet. But uh, next week, next Thursday, we have the uh, COD Season 3 Reloaded, I think. I think Friday we're going to hold Forza because uh, we couldn't get it to align any other time. So we'll see what happens. I'll work it all out. We have the letter from the Hunter's Daughter. skill point. We're going to throw it out here. Now we go here. We go to save. We're officially at 143 hours in. I'm going to go ahead and quit to title screen. So uh, again, we'll be on, like I said, tomorrow from uh, 3 till 6-ish. On We'll be back on this on Monday from uh, probably one thirty to 6, maybe even I'll elongate it a half hour or so. Tuesday will be, you know, 1.30, uh, I mean 1 to 5.30, and the next Wednesday, you know, however it goes, but wait till, uh, you know, Monday, first stream of the day, or Monday Assassin's Creed stream for more info on how the schedule is going to look next week, or refer to our Discord on Sunday night. But uh, we still have a haul tomorrow, then we have a bunch of COD between Friday, Saturday, and our usual, you know, DVD, Minecraft, GTA 5, so... A little break from Valhalla over the weekend. Three-day weekend from Valhalla is kind of how it goes, but tomorrow is more Valhalla before we go into a three-day weekend from Valhalla. So, special thanks to our supporters. BFG Weekly Vlogs, J Smoke Across the Board, BVT on Patreon Membership, and Camster Shark Combo Super Chat. Appreciate the support. Otherwise, thanks for watching, guys. Like and sub. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.